Oh, sorry about that, folks. We're back. Just waiting for Porygon. He should be up here in a moment. Just gonna set the screen share for him. Bleachy Bleach, I'm here. There he is. There's our Porygon. As in the channel's good friend, Porygon. I don't know why you don't wait for me before starting the stream or whatever. Because <laughs> I just in the habit of usually starting five minutes uh, uh, early for my streams just because so to let the intro play out. Oh, okay. Though I got a little distracted and let it re uh, loop back to the beginning, which is a oops, my bad, but thankfully that rarely happens. More often than not, I pay attention and stop uh, right before the loading bar finishes and it loops back. Anyway, we're back with more Pikmin 2. He's going to backseat game me, and like I said in the announcement, he's I'm going to make him proud with at least the first few seconds. But before oh, that, really? uh, Perplexing Pool or Awakening Woods? we got to finish um, the right, right, ground treasures for that. So, in other words, do the boring part. Got it. My popcorn's gonna go to waste. Oh, um, I mean, you know what? Awakening Woods I don't has pick one. Awakening Woods has less above ground treasures. So let's finish those up. Cause I have a feeling with the Wally Wonks and such in Prexing Pool, that's gonna be a bit more pain. There really aren't as many Wally Wonks as you think there. Still, I think the original version anyway, has more. Ready to feel proud? What? Oh, I got 108. Really? You farmed those? Yep. I, I'm am I proud of that? Um, I don't know. I well, at least farmed it enough. So proud of you, gr proud of you grinding. <laughs> I you know, I'm happy. I don't have to watch you grind. That's true. <laughs> You're welcome. I wasn't gonna watch it. <laughs> anyway, uh. Take about forty of my reds. Cause I want to at least figure out where these above ground treasures are. You know where at least one of them is, but I bet you've forgotten. Oh, it's in the area where there's I'll need some blues, isn't it? It's in the what? It's it I'll need some it's in an area where I'll need some blues, right? Uh, yes. I'm gonna guess I can only... Wait, I can't get to the blue to there without clearing the way for them. Because this is the path to where the water is, right? Yeah. There's also a shortcut that you go made a bridge for. Oh, the bridge right. may have been The bridge may have been destroyed, though. You haven't been here in a while. <clears throat> is there's a treasure here though I never got that one either couldn't remember if he got it or not all right there's another red berry it's up plant there. over there yes I know uh, right, there's another red berry plant over here for some reason. I don't know why you would ever use it. The other two are more convenient. Although I guess the other two are covered by mold sometimes. I'll take out 20 of my whites. Too bad you missed the ear doesn't flint beetle over there. He's probably going to leave in like a second. Uh, most of my pigment are pretty already flowered up. I'll lead them to it while I I think I You're already halfway there, just keep going. Let's see. It should be this way? No.
He didn't die instantly, that's unusual. He acted out of trance to shrink them off. That's very rare. Oh. Well, that was convenient that he brought it back. Oh, I knew they would. Didn't you? Didn't you? I was a little afraid that it would be too heavy for them. Oh, nah. I think it's tiny. You threw, like, 20 or more. So where did you find the purples, anyway? Which dungeon did you go to? The exact one you told me to. The subterranean complex. Ah. I didn't actually check and see if that was, like, the best one. There might have been better ones. You should have looked online or something. Well, I could have looked online, but I also didn't want to accidentally spoil myself. Uh, any possible... I don't think that would have been possible. Is there any treasure here? There was. You got it already. Okay, so it's not this way. Or maybe it is, because there's this. Are you using your treasure detector? There's nothing up there. Nothing up there that you haven't gotten already. Or more firmly. You should use your treasure detector more. Keep an eye on it. See, you've been walking past this one, this whole, like, for days. Uh. Oh, hi. Like, you have been... That's one of the earliest ones I noticed, and you've walked past it, like... I need some like, yellows. Like, six times. I need some yellows. Granted, you didn't have yellows the first time you were here, but the second time you were here, you did. I don't know how I walked past that. Honestly, so shocked I you did. didn't get it. I don't know how I walked past that so many times. I did. I feel sorry, and you probably are... because you have your volume absurdly low, so you don't hear the beeping. I really wish you find a way to like make it so your volume can get higher than it is, because you miss so much by not hearing the game sounds. Thirty should be enough. Uh, there is that, and I'm also afraid of picking up on it. I know why you're afraid. I know what you're afraid of, but... I mean, I don't have a solution for you, but I just wish you could find one. Oh well. Eh, I'll look into it, or I'll probably ask. Uh, uh, others, like in John's server, if not John himself. It's difficult, but you could literally, you could technically get headphones. I have headphones. No, I mean, you could get, you could route your aim audio to headphones and probably still get it through the capture card, but it might be complicated. And it's just a theory. Okay, that leaves then only one more left, and that's in the water area that I said. And we still got plenty of the day left. Wait, there's red somewhere? Huh? Oh, it's not red, it's white. What? They're, right, they're opening the grass. Like, they were on screen several times. I don't know why you don't notice them. It's the blending in with the background. They're glowing white. You forget. This is I'll put Mecca on the ground. You notice that? Yeah, but right now I don't think I have any leaves. Well, my point is that the nectar was there. You didn't notice the nectar. No. Mm-hmm. All right. Okay, so I'm trying to remember the water path. It's no. oh, it, it would have been right. Th no, it would have been right. No. Over. It would no. have been right there. That yeah, that, that water. there. Yes. You can actually see water on the map. So. 
No, it isn't in Mar. I just haven't been to this area in a while, so that's why I'm. <clears throat> yep, no, they yep, ate figured the they death. destroyed the bridge. This year, Grubs just destroyed it every once in a while. Eh, fuck you, Grubs. Or shoe. In this case, it might be sheer wigs, I don't remember. Actually, okay. no, they're probably Grubs. I don't think wigs appear here at all. They're only in, like, crafting pool. I know, you're there, buddy. Yeah. You give these things such a wide berth, they're actually pathetic enemies. Oh, he ate one. Fucking kill him, Bleach! I mean, that's a strategy, but I've never found it necessary. They're gonna lose more Pikmin doing that. Nope. We're good. If you had just let them go back onto him instead of whistling him back, you would have been less likely to lose some. Okay, I don't think I have to go that... Nope, I have to go that way. But I have so many meds, I don't... Care at this point. Yep, they're sheer grubs, I thought so. I mean, at best he kills one. Wow. This cork probably gives you like six, <laughs> at least. Hold on a sec, guys, before we. I'm gonna let you guys work on the bridge. You really don't need the bridge, technically. Oh, I'm do I have a different reason. Uh, for them to work on the bridge, so that so that I can have another path, back a faster path you back. You waste so much time micromanaging the Pikmin. So what if one's not helping? It's a minor difference. I see everybody who plays this game do this though. I think like it bothers them when one Pikmin's not doing something. Meanwhile, you waste way more time than that than you would gain by micromanaging it. You expect everyone to play the same way you do? <laughs> I don't know. Did I say I expected it? No. Am I remarking how inefficient it tends to be? Yes. I think everyone's gonna probably change the way they, they play, though. Huh? I couldn't even hear you. I'm saying, do you think everyone's gonna change just because someone's telling? Did I'm asking them to change? No. <laughs> Did I say that? I'm not sure you did. I'll ask you to change because you'll waste my time, but that's it. <laughs> oh god, boy, walks. Mm -mm -mm. A little weird time to change your car camera orientation, if you ask me. You're gonna want to kill at least one of them. You can ignore the first one, the second one probably needs to die. Lost none. Oh, I just lost some. That's because you. Yeah, because oh, all of them were actually anything. on. That's a shame. That's weird. Yeah, it's weird. Sometimes I swear, like, don't kill for some when they should. Oh no, I lost. I, I see one lost, and it was sheer. Are you sure? Yes, I saw blue ghosts. Oh. Hmm. How'd they get up there? I don't know, maybe the Y walk tossed them up there. That's possible, I guess. Hmm. Yeah, I kind of figured that we weren't going to get... Nah, man, you're running out of time. See, not, I, I hope you really don't, really hope you don't spend a second day here. I unfortunately felt I was going to... Really? Man. Hey, at least with the bridges back, I can now get back there faster. Doesn't matter though. It's never. It's obviously not going to take a whole day to do it. You still wasted the day. But I guess you can just go to sunset early, and who cares? It's not like this game has a limited number of them or something. Very well. Yeah, I, I guess that, I guess that shouldn't bother me, and it does. There you go, Bleach. You happy? Yeah.
Even though that I, I have already way too many reds, might as well just <coughs> spend you some. Can pump your yell you can pump your yells up a little bit, maybe you get over a hundred, but that's it. <laughs> Well, I'm going to save some of the stuff to pump up the yellows. Eh, we'll pump up the blues, though. Blues should be able to make it back in time. I guess you did need to kill that one. Actually, that bridge you took down was technically unnecessary. I think they could have just gone the other bridge. For whatever reason, they went they're curing the sheer grubs. They were refusing to go. Well, what, what was the other bridge done? Yes, but that's, uh, that's not. Weird. Okay, that's I guess not, I guess that. But that's not a path right. back. Oh, it is technically if they like, if they're like intelligent, but I guess they're not. <laughs> they just need to fall off the cliff and go to the base. Eh, no there surprise, must it doesn't be work. something there that's preventing them from wanting to go. No, there. nothing. Else. That was Snagret. <laughs> that 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 wouldn't stop them. <laughs> I don't know why that's not a programmed route for them. Yeah, I don't know either. I I, I want to say I swear, like I want to say in Pikmin one, even when the area had water, if you were if blue Pikmin were carrying the stuff back, I think they would still take it into the water. Like in Pikmin one, it worked, but I could be wrong. All right, just bring it back so we can end the day. All right, end the day, get that last treasure, and then we can farm up. Uh, wait, don't! What? You didn't let the seeds produce yet. Uh, we have 100 Pikmin. The number did the number go all the way up? Okay, now it did. See, see, now it's going up. You still have to give it a second. <laughs> If you had ended the day before the number actually went up, it probably wouldn't have gone up. Yeah, something I actually learned during the grind that I didn't know of. If you have... If you go into a dungeon with under 100 Pikmin, but there's some Pikmin on the field outside the dungeon, like at your base camp in the ground, yeah. uh, uh, ground that would make the camp go over 100, some of the Pikmin that you... Who... Uh, to have in your party with the dungeon when you return to the service will then go into whatever storage they go in. So, what? Oh, so in other words, if you enter a dungeon and then increase your total number to 100 while you're in the dungeon, but when you leave... If it, um, if it exceeds 100. So which ones get moved? The ones in your party? Yes. How does it decide that? Interesting. I wonder if one to picks. Or some kind of hierarchy to it. Because I went in one time with purples, and they were gone. I'm like, wait, don't tell me I lost the purples. And then I could swear my count for purples, though, was bigger. That has to be it, because of the, the game. I never thought of that scenario before. Fascinating. Uh, test that now. <clears throat> hmm. There aren't a lot of interest. Yeah, that's what you were saying. It does seem to auto-store them, which is fascinating. I wonder how it decides which color to take first. Is there some kind of hierarchy to it? It might take be purple, purples first, purples whites first. Whites have for uh, take higher priority because they're more special. Yeah, but why? It's arbitrary. For the purpose of storage, it doesn't matter which one gets picked first. I mean, it's completely random. But you said all of your purples were gone. Doesn't sound random. Interesting. Because I would have been upset if I had to regrind some purples just because I made a mistake like that. But I'm glad that it does auto. No, that should not be. A, that should not be a thing. There's. They had to do something that. They deleting them would be stupid. Agreed, and I'm actually glad that I discovered that just by the chance of. It's fascinating. I never, I never thought of the scenario. Granted, the scenario is not super common. The only way to increase your Pikmin number inside a dungeon is through either Queen Candy Pop Buds or Bulbin. Yeah, I guess I guess it's, it's that solution's better than taking some of the grounded Pikmin and putting them back in an onion. That'd be weird, especially if you're banking on flowers. <clears throat> a, a, a kind of an awkward situation for him, but I think it's the best situation. Oh, uh, you have like no blue flowers, bleach. You should. Be, That's you said you're like, oh. like you say you have. Oh, I've got plenty of flowers, but no, you don't. Apparently, the only one I do, will say that mm -hmm. I have plenty of, of don't have plenty of flowers for is. 
Oh, blues. I mean, you only have 40 now. It's not a ton. You could have gotten more out of that nectar. So I have one bud that will... So are you just not interested in farming the berries anymore? Oh no, I'm I'm gonna do farm, I'm gonna farm them later. I'm you not haven't gonna... farmed them in like three episodes, and you've been at a shortage since shower brew. I pretty here. think I wanted to hold on farming them until I cleared this and perplexing pools above ground treasures. Yeah, fingers don't. You could be farming them at the same time as doing this. Oh, that guy's coming up here. You had to kill him. He's in your way. <laughs> He's not going to ignore the Pikmin while you do the puzzle. Wait, do you see where your cursor is? It's not yes. even close to him. <laughs> okay. <laughs> he tossed oh, a nice. Pikmin up there! Amusing. Thanks for the help, Mr. Wallybog. Oh, right, I didn't know that. I wonder if you should have taken more, because I don't know how much that thing ha takes. Because you're only going to have half of them. Is the president not here with you? No, I just realized. Uh, you probably need him, to be honest. How'd you get exactly 20? Wow. <laughs> nice. I don't know. Yeah, so the Pikmin yeah. don't need to be supervised while getting the berries. You could have just after the mold was killed, you could have you could just like I didn't leave kill them the there. Mold. I didn't I kill know, them. but if you did kill the mold, say like yesterday when you had time, you could like you you could be farming berries right now. That's all I'm saying. Also, the number is exactly even, so I don't think anything's gonna happen. Yeah, you need one more. Armor just let's have Armor throw one off. There you go. Please be enough. Oh, yeah, that, that's definitely enough. Good. All right. I was afraid it might be like 20 or 25. Now you should. So if you want to maximize your time, I guess spend the rest of the day with berries. Or if you want to maximize my satisfaction, you, you leave immediately once you have this. <laughs> your choice is yours. <laughs> Uh-oh. Why are they going that way? Oh, so they do go that way. I wonder why they weren't before. That's weird. Well, the Snagger is probably going to appear. Yep, there he is. Yep. Let's see if he actually gets. Let's see if he gets any. Oh, come on. I was well, quick. I'll, on I'll, that. Bet, I'll bet they could have gotten away. He takes so long to like get up. I'm gonna. Have now to it's fight probably him. too late. <clears throat> you not do not have to fight him. Oh, and there's a. I forgot that was there. I very rarely walk over there. You what? This is a risky. Well, okay, move. now you're, you're. Oh, you're. Oh, now you see. Like you decide too late when you want to like go for this. Now you lost pick, but you probably wouldn't have if you were a little like more decisive. Whoa! Where are those twenty up here? Those are rare. What's rare? The twenty. This giant flower bleach is twenty. That's it. The one on the cliff. Yeah, I saw. I'm gonna get. Oh, okay. I'm gonna get that with the yellows. <clears throat> so I was apparently wrong. Uh, and you were right. I think I needed to fight it, so I kind of panicked again. Right? Yeah. If you if you had uh, let the the snagger takes so long to like end his starting animation, I think they could have just like walked out of its range at that point. At best, at, at worst, the thing kills like three Pikmin. It could only pluck three of them. How many can the like in comparison? How many can the how many can the creeping chrysanthemum pluck? 
like one or two. You'd think you can get more, but no. Very low number. Gripping Cassandra sucks. That's why I keep saying that you like treat them as way more of a threat than they are. I'm gonna check that to be sure, but in my experience, they have never like grabbed more than like one or two. I don't even know if that information is available though. their work here while the president just farms up some yellows. We will be ending the day to speed up your time, so I'm going to kind of do half and half of uh, farming uh, berries and yellows and... Oh, trying to speed. please everyone, huh? Yes. And then you please none. <laughs> and of course, because sometimes we can't have it <coughs> both ways, because... Mm, people on the internet are stupid, honestly, sometimes. Ah, too bad it's red. It's unfortunate. It does not say how many Pikmin the Creeping Chrysanthemum can pick up. But in my experience, it's never been more than, like, a couple. Apparently, some people on this wiki, like, had trouble with this thing. I don't know how. People have trouble with many, many different things. Sometimes even bosses are, like, That's stupid. That's weird. Even, even when I was a kid, I found those things to push, that's a push over. <laughs> Whatever. Do I have now? Putting it in here. Got the yellows in the hundreds. Ah, oh, better kill that thing. Lasagna. That's the. Oh, I suppose that's the only thing that you'd want. That you'd like want to keep someone supervising the Pikmin for the inevitable appearance of that stupid thing. I mean, to be fair, if there, you have a lot of Pikmin there, they would likely knock it off before it can even... What, I, I think what actually happens if it does try and crawl on with their Pikmin already on it, falls off immediately. So, you know, I, you never mind. It doesn't actually do anything unless you're not there at all. Unless there's no Pikmin there at all. It's like berry production is completely automated. And almost. You need someone to, like, reset the Pikmin occasionally. But they can almost do it on their own completely. Because even when they come off, they'll all, a lot of them will automatically try climbing right back up. So as soon as like more berries spawn, more of them will like go back up. But sometimes they fall too far away and then they don't go up automatically. That's when you need to reset them. Yeah. Let's just keep one captain in the vicinity while the other captain actually does stuff. That's it. Just check on them every few minutes. I mean, that's why. So oh, maybe you should maybe you should try. Doing it with the purple ones in Perplexing Pool when you go back. It's the purple ones are arguably more important, if you ask me. I mean, there's some purple ones here. Yeah, but not, not as many. It takes twice, it takes twice as long to get a large number of them here. Perplexing pool, but and since we're going to perplexing pool next anyway, why not try and split up the work? True. Okay, these will be the last batch of berries for both, and then we will. And to be confirmed, these berries are gone in Pikmin 3, right? 
Ah, uh, yeah. Take it back and then we are going to be done for the day. As in done for this day. That's definitely a lot of berries farmed. Mm. Yeah, my popcorn is done. You didn't even get to do anything fun. What a shame. Should have known this would happen. I also wanted to ask again, like, wh which of the Paper Mario's did you want to see me? Thousand Year Door, easily my favorite. So you One's after Super Paper Mario. Okay, well, you want my opinion on the entire Mario Paper Mario series? Sure. Since it's a, since it's a subject of such a debate, quote unquote, or discussion at least. Um, first is good. It's really good. Uh, not my favorite. I feel like it didn't age as well as Thousand Year Door. Thousand Year Door is my favorite. I feel like it took everything the first one did well and did it better, mostly. Uh, Super Paper Mario was some stories, amazing. Gameplay was just whatever. Really easy game, too. Like, even easier than the first two, which probably seems impossible. After that, they all kind of just bleh. Sticker Star is impressive, <laughs> to say the least, and how... Everyone and how many weird design is the and how many worst. wide and how and how many weird design choices they made? It's just Im impressive in that regard. Color Splash is a lot better because I think the writing, the gameplay isn't as atrociously bad. I think, and the writing is just as good, if not better, in Color Splash. I played a little bit of it. It's not a horrendous game, but it's not. I, okay, that, that's that's saying that's not giving enough credit. It is a good game. It is not what I want from Paper Mario, though. <laughs> Yeah, um, that's kind of. And there's I, a lot of things about Color Splash I don't like, like the battle system. Battle system is. Um, I don't like coloring cards. I think it's really slow and clunky, and makes battles take forever. And you know what? Uh, that's something Sticker Star and it have in common. Battles suck, and you usually just want to avoid them. <laughs> yeah, that's what I got out of reading some of Chugga's Twitter comments. Basically, he still considers Sticker Star the worst of the Paper Mario games, and said that while well, he got bored and then enough to not want to finish Color Splash uh, because of its gimmicky battle uh, system. A system that he didn't like. It, he, he acknowledges that it did some things better than Sticker Star at least. Yeah. Color Splash is a step up from Sticker Star. I don't think anything's going to get as bad as that again, fortunately. Origami King, he said he just uh, due to how bad the presentation was that Nintendo gave off before the game came out, he just felt uninterested to buy it. That's fine. I don't know if I'll buy it. I'll buy it eventually, maybe. Not at launch, for sure. I'm not paying full Some price, people have so. been telling him that it is at least better than both Color Splash and Sticker Star. Well, that's good. I I'm Maybe they can take the series in a direction where I can be genuinely happy it exists. But right now, nothing's gonna nothing's gonna make me prefer it over the RPGs. And I, 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 I mean, the real RPGs, yeah, that... not the... Kind of one kind yeah, of RP. Chuck just seems to just like want them to at least go back to the roots that they had like in Thousand Year Door and Super Paper Mario because those were I think his favorite of the. Oh hi! I didn't realize you guys were still here. Those were apparently his favorite of the Paper Mario games, from what I can tell, and I get some people telling him try certain games. It's his decision, but some of them, some people are just idiots on Twitter as usual. Getting on his case for not wanting to. Uh, to I didn't want to talk about Chuck Conroy, to be fair, please. <laughs> so it's, it's. That's fierce. Although, well. you're, although you are preaching to the. Not, not only are you preaching to the choir, um, all of this is very hap hat. Um, old story happens all the time, happens to literally every person who has. Who has any sort of popularity or any person ever really whatever all right now you gotta see if you can find this mystery treasure you could not figure out before it 
Let's see. I'm gonna follow the. You might want to kill the wall. You should probably kill the wally walk. Just, a, just, a, just, um, just, um, uh, suggestion. I think I'm le learning to actually handle them better now. That's good. Unfortunately, no matter how good you get at handling them, there's always a bit oh, of risk. Oh, good lord. I think it, it's underground, isn't it? So, it's weird. You, like, went over the spot, like, ten times and couldn't figure it out last time, and now you figure it out immediately. I don't know what was on your mind last time. I thought it was But yes, somewhere... you do need whites here. How are you going to get them here? There's got to be something to unclog the water. No, there isn't. I'll tell you that straight up. You already unclogged the water. That's That's... This water, you can't get rid of. Oh, no. How do I get them over? There's a way. There's a will, there's a way. I should at least... Leave the present here with the blues, just in case I find. Well, I let all marks explore out. This one I'm gonna need to probably use most of the day to figure it out because I need to explore and figure out how to get them over. Okay, wait. There's something. No, I can't use that to get them over there. But I see a wall. Aha! I think. Yes! I found it! And here I was about to say I'm gonna need majority of the day to figure it out. I did not need majority of the day. <laughs> it really isn't that, like, hard to figure out, if you ask me. You pretty just do exactly what you did and you figure it out. Yeah, as I was trying to say, though, for Wally Wall, like, I think I figured out why you say, like, oh. they're not as bad as people make out. Well, more like I don't find this game was... Well, okay, I, I don't know. Wild logs are really annoying, and they feel bad because even... It feels like when you do everything perfect, they can still kill Pikmin, and that that is how they work, really. So I can understand that. They cause... Are they the worst thing? The, and they can, potentially, if you're unlucky or play poorly enough, kill your entire army in one fell swoop. That can happen. And that is probably why everybody... Every, why they stick out in so many people's minds is this awful thing. But, I don't know, I, you know, I find, I like, it's not like, well, I don't like wallet, it's not like I um, think wallet wogs are easier than they are, it's more like I enjoy the fact that they are difficult to deal with, because so many things in this game are not, that's, that's what I'm trying to say, I, I think that's what I was saying last time, if I remember it. I, maybe? Yeah, you know, I fucking... I, I, somebody... This came up multiple times now. If there was a boss version of Wally Logs. I got Everyone would flip their shit. I'd love every second of it. Oh, I was the one that, think, that asked what would it do. Oh, I don't know. Probably jump really high or something. I I, I haven't a clue. I have, it just sounds funny. Also, um, to respond to your oh, the water dumples, <laughs> they carried him back the uh, unsafe way. Oh well. Oh well. Uh, um, wally wogs. Uh, you know, honestly, I don't. I can't recall ever seeing a wally log like kill a significant number of Pikmin while carrying something. Oh, what? It actually knocked them down. <laughs> it knocked them Excuse off. Use me. <laughs> Just like okay. Now jumping. I know that happens. That was weird. Like bumped up against it and they fell over. Huh. Have I ever seen that happen before? Nor have I. All right. Well, um, uh, yeah. Getting back to what you said before, Mr. Commenter. Um, oh yeah. Uh, I don't like the sticker system. I don't like the card system. I don't like the system of consumable That's cash attacks. In the comments. Yeah, I don't remember his name. <laughs> I know I've seen it before. But then I get your then I get everybody's names mixed up because everybody seems to have a different name on Twitch for some reason. Be huge. Have HP. Everything else. <laughs> That could actually work. <laughs> That'd be the ultimate troll. <laughs> they wouldn't do it, though, but it'd be funny. Okay, I, 
got to figure out where some of the other treasures are that I could have missed. I think there was one that you said was here, with the same path with the yellows. I think? No. Why? Why would you say? Oh, oh so you would be trying to get purple. Is there I get the purple sprays? I'm going to do that. I'll do that after the treasure. The treasures are my priority oh, right now. Leech, I'm trying to tell you, you can do both at once. Okay, fine, I'll... Just, just go set them, go, and have one, uh, one, one captain supervise them occasionally. It takes no effort. I, I know where, I don't remember how many you have left, but I, I know where one of them is. I don't remember if you got all the rest. Okay, these guys gotta go first off. You, you have to kill them, yeah. They're gonna eat Pikmin taking a spray the berries back. That, that forgetting about these happens a lot to me, and then I end up losing a lot to them. Yeah, I, that's pretty much how I feel. Uh, more of them. These are the ones that usually destroy the bridge. I'm surprised they did not destroy the bridge. <laughs> I think I'm gonna have to do, actually bring reds for it because I see a fiery blowhog there. Actually, mm -hmm. wait, where are you going exactly? I'm going for the berries, like you said. Is that a little fiery blowhog? Oh, fiery, I'm sorry, fiery blowhog. Yes, there is. Uh, will he bother you? I don't know. Maybe. He's just, by yeah. where the mold is. Just, just use reds for it, then. There's no reason to use blues. Then, they, then he can't do anything. Unless he tosses the blues into the water, but then I can just whistle them back. Yeah, like, I actually looked, though, for uh, the two Paper Marios, and unfortunately, it seems only the original Paper Mario is uh, on uh, the Wii U store. They have none of them on a Switch store. Yeah, they don't usually care that much about doing it. That's why emulation exists. Yeah, and considering that Thousand Year Door likely costs, uh, I'm gonna guess six hundred dollars on Amazon. <laughs> don't it, don't look it up. Don't look it. I'm looking I'm, it up. Oh, you're looking up just to confirm for me, aren't you? Yes. It definitely does not cost six hundred dollars. That's stupid. Ah. Huh. Regardless, well, it's gonna be. A this one costs eight hundred dollars, so technically I'm still correct. Um, what? Oh, this one. Oh, that's a replacement case. Um, God damn it. <laughs> All right, fine. I guess you win, Bleach. Oh, <laughs> wow. All right, yeah, don't buy this. Don't buy this game online. <laughs> At least on eBay. Why eBay? Because that's what Google brought me to first. I didn't look for eBay specifically. So why not eBay, Bleach? That's where you find, like, secondhand stuff, usually. You never did get okay. that treasure, did you? Because the gate's no. still there. Yep. Okay, that's gonna be my next one. And I'm pretty sure I know the other one you're for you haven't gotten to, so that's. Eh, yeah, you're gonna need these two days, maybe even three if you're particularly slow about it. I'm just trying to mon figure out where all of them are. None of them there. Sixty dollars oh, pre-owned. Yeah. Well, you know, I bet you can buy it from like. GameStop pre-owned, too. <laughs> Don't go to fucking eBay. <laughs> I'm gonna need blues for here. Oh, this is a puzzle. It's quite a bit more annoying than the old one in Pikmin 1, if you ask me. Get him off there and just...
coward. Okay. And now you can basically. So, if you really don't want to waste time, just ignore him, because he doesn't actually do any damage. In fact, even if he like causes you to lose pick to like lose track of Pikminar, they won't even die if you leave him behind because they'll be underground. At least you make sure they get back to the base safely. Uh, you got plenty of time for that. <laughs> Good. Ideally, you get even more sprays than that. Oh, oh, they're not flowers yet. I would wait for them to. I wait to uproot those blues for them to become flowers. You need more of them anyway. Oh no, more two more of those grubs. That sucks. They're gonna eat all those berries. You can't fight. You're never gonna be able to kill them as a captain in time. So I at least found where two treasures are. I don't know that where sucks. the other one those, is. Those berries grew back way fast. I think this is a... This leads to a treasure, doesn't it? This... No, I got the treasure here, I think. Got the treasure that was around here already. So I am just trying to plan my uh, route. Oh, go! Oh, they're all flowers now. Excellent. And we'll just end the day since I at least know where two treasures are, and I can easily plan my route now. <coughs> I had questions like, does GameStop even still sell GameCube games? I don't see why they wouldn't, but who knows. I just have no way to go to GameStop right it's now. If I was Why not? I have no rot aid current uh, oh. during the pandemic. What do you mean? What do you mean you have no ride during it? I can't get uh, hit there. Why not? No one to drive me. No one will drive you. Why does the pandemic matter for that? Plus, with some I of the news I've heard, I really don't trust GameStop right now. Huh? Never mind. Okay. It's like you can't drive, but more like she won't drive you. Is that the idea? No. Then I don't get it. I really can't say this on stream, okay? Oh, oh, well, no, just say that then. Fine. Sorry. So, three more left, and I found two of them. Mm, they do have pre owned Thousand Year Door for $59.99. Yeah, that's something I could look on. Looking to probably get to be honest, you can often buy GameStop shit online. I actually had it. I actually, I don't know if you can buy pre owned stuff because it varies by store, but I was able to buy new stuff and get it shipped right to me. Easy. This particular game seems like it's out of stock in locations near me, at least, but you never know. Okay, I'm gonna tr try and do some multitasking here then. Good. I love it. First, let's confirm where the... You may have is. to deal with sheer gwags on the way to that one. The Wally Log may also present, be, present a problem, but I don't think it will. I think you just walk past it. I think I can just walk past as well. Because you, the Pikmin aren't going to be carrying the treasure back this oh. way anyway. There are sheer wigs, but... I think they may have, like, snagged a couple, but nope. oh well. Nope, they did not. I, you only had 25? Where are the other three? Yes. Oh, okay. They're, blue, they're reds underground as leaves oh, okay. currently. I don't know if that's an... Oh, well, you're just breaking on the gate. That's fine. Yes. Okay. 
You should whistle them now and then walk around. Yep, there you go. You can safely touch the gate too, by the way, you're electric proof. Okay, I think the next one... What I'm gonna need is... Some blues. What I'm gonna do is actually let the president escort this these amount of blues, clear some of the path open for them so the blues can carry the treasure back because there's water. And then Armor can just escort the yellows back. Lost one blue. Lost one, so big deal. We'll worry about that stuff later. Now I don't think that Wally Walk's gonna pay attention to us. Oh, doubtful. Are you getting berries? Uh, I need Olimar here to escort the yellows back to safety. Yeah, well, when they're done, you need him there. They're not done. Why are you just staring at Olimar, then? Like, What? Okay. Who's huh? going to carry the treasure back, then? The blues, with the president. Who's going to toss the yellows, then, back over and squirt them back? The president, after he puts the Pikmin on the treasure. Okay. <laughs> I don't understand the problem. For best results, make sure that you're not controlling the president when the bait gets finished. Because then the Pikmin will oh, try shoot, shoot. may try and move to him. Yeah. Yeah, don't don't Okay, he's probably far enough away, but still. To be perfectly safe, I would make sure you're not controlling them at the moment because the Pikmin may attempt to rush over to them when they're finished, and that will bring them into the water. So just wait for like the uh, you know little yeah, I sound. Heard the I heard it. I heard it. Uh, so in, in that case, it's safe to switch back. Yep. So just like dismiss them and go back. Yeah, like just you can just um yeah, just bring them in. Make sure only blues are on that, obviously. Actually, no, don't do that yet because they're because the yells are gonna help. The yells on the way out. Whistle the other yells to you first. Hold on, I got an idea for this. Just trust me on this. Okay, that works too. Even better than my idea. Good. Why is there one yellow left? Okay. <laughs> and there you go. There's only one more you need. Uh, he's on the bridge now? How'd he get there? What he jumped ass? on it! But he stayed there? You see he goes back to his starting place? I think he's just stuck there. What an asshole. Maybe he can't get back. Oh shit! Oh, that was so oh, nice one. Why do you walk into him? <laughs> okay. I was trying to go past him. I know. And then... Jeez. Eh, sure, we'll let them take these back. And I just... Whatever, blue and yellows, whichever one it gets it, gets it. Oh, that was my own fault for whistling that close. Okay, the next one I'm gonna need just blues for. I know that one much. 
And I might need to kill that Wally Wonk. away okay, that was just a blue a toss that's fine let's take all the blues I can for this one Oh, now he goes back to his original location. I don't know what's up with this guy. <laughs> maybe you leave. Maybe you... no. That can't. That can't be it. I have no idea. <laughs> yeah, this guy I'm gonna have to kill. Um. Well, I don't know how much they affect like you returning treasure, but if what happens before happens again, then yeah, I guess so. <laughs> He's dead. Oh, nice. You got him while he was, like, moving back, too. That's even better. That's how he jumps in the, like, high in the air, the better. I need to handle these guys one at a time. At least I think. Yes, I will, actually. From the looks of it. So I can't get up there. And there's a... Yeah, that would be the way you did it in Pikmin 1. It doesn't look like it's possible now. So you have to, so now you have to use the stupid weight things. You should probably kill these guys, though. Oh, <laughs> that was not the way to do it. <laughs> Can't be so close to them. Because then you have no time to get them when they come out. I'm trying to bait him. You, well, you're baiting him, but the problem is he's getting the bait and then getting away with it. There you go, it's better. That guy's gone. Good. Now for the other one. Come on. Rush him! Alright, very good. I'll make sure the water dumbles are dead, too. So now you see how it works, right? Oh, this is, this, is an this is an annoying one. Oh, you. He decided to come over. Weigh him down and kill him. Good. Not now, guys. Guys, it's you're gonna have a real hard time stopping them from doing that. Okay, I'm trying to figure this one out. You're gonna probably need two captains for this. I think it's the only way it's gonna be really possible. I think. So, Bleach, try and walk on to the one closest. Like, I want you to notice something. They're, they're, they don't go into the water at different... Like, they go into the water at different heights. Like, see, go try and walk on to the one that's, like, next to it. Oh, I yeah, I know. I couldn't I don't get... Think, I couldn't. I don't think, yeah, now exactly. I see how... You yeah, have to go in order. <laughs> Somewhat, at least. And let's just... That's an important but not very easily noticed detail. You, I wonder if you, if you, if you do, yeah, I don't know. I'm 
sorry, I'm trying to get finish these treasures all in so as fast as possible. These treasures are proving more tricky than I thought. Well, I didn't say anything. I was gonna take back what I was about to say. I'm thinking like maybe you do need another day, but I'm I'm not so sure. If you, I think if you really tried, you'd have enough time. But I'm not sure. God, this bull bear is being a. Wow, that spooking stitch bug is just being a jerk and Those are not gonna make it. The ones that are farther along probably will. And the moss is coming back, I have seen it. Ah, that's obnoxious. Well you can well what you can do is spend the rest of your day beating down the frickin' mold. No, they'll they'll make it back. Okay. Oh, better get better uproot those yellows. Nope, they're not going to make that one back at least. That's still a good amount of Pikmin <laughs> gained, I think. So I guess one bright side, I guess, is I am upping my pick, my basic Pikmin numbers more and more. Because if I know anything within some of the final areas, of Pikmin games, not counting Pikmin 1's final area that was just the final boss. What? Mm, I guess you lost a couple. How? Mm. But yeah, like I'm saying, like I will make an exception at least, uh, and get an ISO for uh, Paper Mario Thousand Year Door if you really want to backseat that as well. I do. <laughs> no, no, no. That sounds like a scam. What did you say? Designer items at a cut rate price. Your bonus, I send them your bonus check. Oh my god. Good lord. Okay, I'll need the present here. Overkill amount of blues, but I want to at least make sure we get this done and have plenty, hopefully, for whatever the last treasure might be. Because I still haven't found the way the last one is.
missed some of that nectar, but that's still a good chunk. And the eggs right there that I remember you mentioned long ago is like, what eggs? <laughs> so yeah, those things that scared the pig. What? I don't even remember me saying that. Oh, right, right, right. I figured out what those bug things uh, drop if you manage to kill them that sometimes pop out of the eggs. They drop a lot of ne nectar. Oh, they do if you can manage to kill them. Purples are particularly effective at it. They flatten them all pretty much immediately. And that's the problem, like, you gotta know how to kill them fast because Pikmin tend to, for whatever reason, panic when they see them. I think this should be good enough. So, first up's for first up, you need to toss you here. No, that's not gonna work. All right, that has to. Be okay, this one controls nope, it controls that one, but getting that up there first is probably the smart move. weird I can't get oh I think I get it oh. so that's how this is gonna work and this one I need to weigh down Correct. No, that's the wrong one. Oh shit! I whistled too hard. You know, I'm taking as few pigmen as po possible to at least get the captain up there. You actually only need the captain up there because I'm pretty sure you can throw the rest of your Pikmin up there directly. In that case, uh, down you go. And what I need to do now is wave this one down let the present go on here weigh that so present can go on not that yet but we're getting there I think this one weighs yes and then I just go one there. That was not as complex as I thought it would be. It really tries to trick you that it's more complex than it is. From what I is that would you agree? Uh, yes. I don't know. That's weird. Oh, I see now. No? How come I can't get them up there? There we throw go. Them up yeah, like throw them there. That's what I thought you were gonna do. Okay. 
Oh, that was plenty. Wow. Oops, I accidentally whistled so many. Now I need to find where that last treasure is, because there's one more. I've been looking, but I can't find it. In this scenario, the best solution I can think of is split up, leave the president here. The guys with the treasure should be fine. At best, the swooping snitch bug is going to just come swoop in and pick some of them off, but whatever. And I gotta find where that last treasure is. Not in you. I'm just checking to make sure it's not in an enemy. Oh. Yeah, there is one here. more I forgot about. Oh, forgot about that one completely. Okay, that makes things easier. I, get, I can actually just run there with the whites and some reds. I can actually just take these blues because they're here right now and I can let the president manage these. Yeah, we're actually going to finish all the remaining tre above ground treasures today. I was hoping you would. <laughs> You've taken three days now. I know, more than I was kind of expecting. I'm kind of surprised. Wow, that blue is... <laughs> Look at that blue! Oh. How'd he live?! I don't know how he's surviving. What the heck is... Fucking maniac. I, I want to just watch this guy 1v1. The I, wanna... I kind of want to too! I want to see if he kills him! He might not because he keeps getting back on before he jumps. Uh-oh. That should kill him. Uh, rest in peace, my friend. I think he's, he should be dead, although I didn't see the ghost. Yeah, they're, they're, too, they're normally too slow to catch them. That was actually kind of funny, though, I'll admit. See that Pikmin 1v1 dead? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh great, so even Cash is gonna backseat me for a thousand year door. Great. This is kind of why sometimes I like getting Porygon exclusive right it's to the back seat. <laughs> Gets too crowded when too many people talk anyway. Besides, I think I know. I think I know how to do a good job of that without playing the game for you. Yeah, you and Sturm both, uh, honestly.
Alright, come on. Well, our bitter spray count is definitely up now. Whoops. Too soon whistled. Come on, get those berries off. Those will be the last berries we'll farm. Any more I'll do off screen, but I think for now it's time for the real fun to begin. Wouldn't you say? Yes, I agree. First thing though, um, I don't think that those leaves are going to spawn into flowers. Unfortunately, so I want to make sure that my count is indeed 68 out of 68, so good. That means we've not left any pigment behind, I think. I'm sorry if I keep getting feel like I keep getting off track for the Wally Wally one. I think I'm beginning to realize that because of the sheer amount of Pikmin they can kill being the highest out of almost any enemy in the game. I did say that, yes. Not out of not counting the bosses. Out of I am. people tend to panic. I know. Oh, I, I said that as part of my okay. reasoning. Oh, that I probably forgot or just was focusing on the treasure that I didn't hear that you say that. Bugs love Louie a lot. Hmm. Yep. Got our pose completed. Waking moves completed and perplexing pool completed. Which leaves only the wistful wild left with three dungeons and five above ground treasures. Here we go, final area at last. It's here at last, Porygon. Fucking finally. Yield? I just, did that, does that say yield? Probably. Oh, yeah, it definitely does. Begins by saying, "What kind of hell oh, we're in? Oh, that is what's the red one's called? The the red armored cannon beetle larva is called decorated cannon beetles. So there's your treasure with uh, some 100 purples. It's right over behind you. I see it now. I'm gonna." It least... takes, like, fucking... Despite it being close to your base, it still takes some fucking ages to bring it back, if I remember right. Thank God they had the, like... Mer Thank God they were merciful enough to do that. Well, let's get that treasure out of the way first, then. Let's see, and... Oh, we have a few leaves. <laughs> How unfortunate. God, look at the most OP Pikmin army ever. I'm trying to get some nectar for the leaves to I speed them up a bit. 
I wonder if it. I wonder if it's gonna matter. I hope that's all of them. Well, you want I'm, what I'm gonna do to help speed it up even more? Oh wait, I know what to do to help speed it up even more. First, make sure they're all over here. Oh, good idea. But the problem is you're very low on spray. I can farm up the red spray if needed. There is spray farming here. I just don't remember what color. If it's not, if not both. Go, guys, go. Good lord, I hate this <laughs> game sometimes. What is that? They're still slow. What? It's even worse than I expected. Oh my god. Well, and we you can't do you, it. you tried. Well, you go explore the area like you, like you like to do. It's all you can do, so you might as well. Keep, actually, recommendation, keep one captain back just in case. I am a little afraid by that just in case. Thank God that's just a swooping, regular swooping stitch bug, and not something much. Worse. I don't think the bumblings ever appear. Um, the bumbling ones ever appear above ground. So remember how every area you've been to has been like an area. Oh, you've I see someone here yeah. I don't like. Yeah, that's what I'm afraid. The groink kind of just move. The groink does not, because of how groinks work, they don't just stay in one area. They move around. Theoretically, they can come to your base and bother you. It has happened to me before, I think. So, that's why I keep present there, just in case the groink does go over, happen to wander over. Hey, you should, you shouldn't, you shouldn't, like, bank on it, though, because he probably won't. Just a precaution, though. It's the area where we first landed for the final boss. That's correct. This is the final trial. Actually, no, this is not the final trial. It's this No, this is the final trial and landing site combined or something. I don't remember. I can't remember. It, it, this It's like both or something? Because this is where... The, remember here, right there. Wait, where you're walking? Yeah, I saw. Yeah, this is the landing site right around here. Where that orange bulb orb is where the Mamuda usually is. The engine is actually where that rock is. I'm sorry, the cave rock. <laughs> so I need purples there. But I'm going to need to clear that... Well, I'll get out of the way with blues. Yeah, so it's weird. It's like the final trial and the original area combined. What Don't really get is it. This? Okay. So, this is the closest one. Oh, there's one right there, huh? It is horrifying. Courage is the only thing but reckless. This is something else. Perhaps we should turn back. Well, if you still wish to enter, I can. Okay, what's the name of this one? I want to just see the name. I don't remember which one's which. Cavern of oh, Chaos. Oh, this is Cavern of Chaos. Oh, I don't even remember who I, what, what's in this one, to be honest. Oh, thank God they're back. Okay, yeah. Fortunately, they were the developers were nice enough to put them to put the thing somewhat close. It's a it's worth is might be what most the treasure worth the most out of the ones you've gotten though. And the name is fitting. <laughs> All right, yeah. Put those purples back before something bad happens to them. So now you don't need pur farm purples anymore. Feel free to like do use them for anything, since since they're like. Super valens, there's their mega value has kind of come to an end. You're just wasting them by not using them at this point. Also, I'm pretty sure where you land is where you, yeah, where you land, Bleach is where you fought the Emperor Bullblox. Right uh. here, you can see that that back area with stuff is still there. Kind of. Ooh. I don't even know if there's anything up there. There are usually bomb rocks up here, but I guess nothing right now. I mean, there's stuff for hunt me, but nectar, whatever. Do we even go into the cavern of chaos now? Oh, 
Rip that bumbling snitch bug. Okay, I can see why you say so much about these purples. Purples are dumb. Purples are dumb. <laughs> Fuck an army of pur if you're if you're doing nothing but fighting, you might as well just eschew blue reds completely. <laughs> they are outclassed by purples. <laughs> Aside from being slow, that's their only downside. Honestly, if you want to make if you want to put the game on like somewhat easy mode, make a sizable portion of your army purples every time you do anything. <laughs> I kind of like you not using purples all the time, though, to be honest, but... <laughs> this is the final one. I don't know what's going to be in store, but... Well, are we going to go to Cavern of Chaos right now? Oh, that sounds fun. Might as well. I don't even remember it very well. I had, The Wistful Wild Dungeons I have some of the haziest memory on, so <laughs> I'm going to be about as surprised as you half the time. No, actually, uh... Let's bring ten. Let's bring thirty blues instead. I think ten yellows should be enough. Okay, our lineup is forty reds, ten yellows, ten purples, ten whites, and thirty blues. And thank God, all of them are flowers. Uh, what better place to start than Cavern of Chaos, which is hell. Now, I'm sure you would tell me, though, if you remembered correctly, which one was the final boss dungeon. Because you want me to likely go in that one last. As in once all the... Dream Den. Dream Den is the final one. Go in that one last. It's probably the hardest one to reach anyway, so you'll probably find it last anyway. Dream Den is where Louie is, so go there last. Yeah, I'm not planning to go to the Dream Den until the other dungeons in this place are... Oh, this place looks nat. Oh. <laughs> Let's start by removing the hazards. Take your time. Only the, the only the Gronks really, like, make, make a beeline for you on the floor. Why are you zoomed in? Please. Honestly, being zoomed out is actually a pretty good thing to do, if you ask me. I wanted to make sure I was throwing the right one. I wonder. Keep your eyes focused on the Pikmin. Sorry if this is a little annoying, but... Just punch the rock, Bleach. I'm pushing it to them. So... Oh my god, well... <laughs> I don't think you need to push that close. Suckers! Fucking, like, gal fucking galaxy brain strategies and Bleach here. You might be too close. Okay, you're not, though. I don't only, uh, well, whatever. You kind of like cheese that otherwise difficult part where you'd have to like use both colors to be, or you could just like cheese them with purples too. That also works. <laughs> fuck using the fuck using the intended color to fight them. Uh, we just throw purples at them. Oh good, no! Have you not learned? <laughs> Somebody has forgotten to be wary of treasures in corners. That's something that not that you can't even scout for. I'm pretty sure they won't appear until the until the Pikmin start carrying it.
Okay, good. The Let's get these out of the way at least. Can the bombs take out those traps? I want to say yes, but I don't know. Uh, I think so. I don't know if they're close enough. Hmm, clever. Yep, they destroy yep. him. Qu quite immediately, in fact. Let's at least take out the other bomb rocks. So, the one other bomb rock here. So I can... Oh, that red's a goner. Lost one red. Oh well. Oh shit! Guys, oh my god, you guys are so lucky. Oh my god, you guys are so lucky. My god, I can't believe they survived that. Oh, that's why. A white. Oh, three whites. I hope you saw that, Porygon. Uh, I think you just dodged a bunch of bombs. Yeah. God. Well, I hope you're ready for a long dungeon. All of them in this file, they're gonna be long. How long is this dungeon? Ten floors. And this is probably the shortest one. So I only lost... About seven Pikmin so far, because I went in with an army of a hundred. I don't know if there's Bulbman in some of them, but I'm not too concerned about Bulbman right now. Um... Spooky. Second floor, and you already have a spider web in the fire. Um. Uh... Um. Uh... Hmm. I need the reds for this. Fortunately, it's not actually a, a boss. <laughs> this literally is the same arena that um, that uh, Man at Legs had, though. Well, mostly. I think some of the... It's, it might be a little different. Yeah, it is the same arena, because I can see... I'm not doing a great job with that. Hmm. I have these for a reason. Yeah, you have to be careful here. You don't. Oh, if, you lose all your red, if you lose all your reds, these are gonna be these things are gonna become nigh impossible to kill. There's no water to put them out either. I'm aware. So I would recommend not fighting all of them. Fight whatever ones have treasures. This guy has a treasure. He does, yeah. Yeah, you're gonna have to do that. There's another. Fortunately, you have to waste two right off the bat like that, but. I can oh, regain we'll two. Again. There's a spray right there. Yeah, fine, but still bad to use them. 
I guess you did really get lucky that one came up. I'm pretty sure it doesn't matter if Pikmin are with you for this trick. <laughs> yeah, I just don't want them in the way. Okay, there's still... Got it. Oh, you barely got it. <laughs> It's gonna be real unfortunate if all of them have treasures. Oh man, they all have treasures. <laughs> you can try and not use the spray. It'd be more risky. It would, sure, but I, th I think the problem what you had the first time, I think part of the problem is that you weren't throwing all of them onto its back. You threw until he, once he woke up, you started missing. That's so weird, eh? It happens a lot with you, to be honest. That's all of them. Fiery bulb boxes. One of me, you can't cheese with purples. At least as long as it's on fire. Might still be able to stun them, though. Hopefully I can count some Queen Candy Pop above two. I'm sure you'll find a rest floor at some point. Long dungeons like this will always have at least one. Yeah, at least it's not like the 99 fours in Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. God, I never finished any dungeon that was that long. I'll be honest, the only reason I finished them Was because I had. Oh, Buddha. Are we on a rest floor already? No. Do not be deceived. There are enemies here. I see yeah, them. Yeah, I see them as well. The Mamuda actually might make killing those. Oh! <laughs> the Mamuda just fucking died. <laughs> Can I please get those Pikmin back? You lost seven. Big whoop. You did not react well to that rock at all. Well, all right, the Mamuda won't be a problem anymore. That's something. I was going to say the Mamuda might make killing the other enemies annoying, if not really difficult, but now he's dead. Now you see how how these things get cheesed by purples. You don't you don't even need to do this. To throw purples onto it. Bitch. I was trying to get them off. Oh, he's stuck. Perfect. Now he's mega screwed. He ate some... Aw, oh, he ate some purples. See, the problem you have is you don't have enough purples. Ten isn't really enough. Because the problem with that is that the next per Pikmin in line are whites, and you don't really want to be throwing whites. They actually do the least damage in the game, as I, I believe. Well, Could there's be wrong poison traps, and I don't know if there's... Or they do no more damage than any of the other colors, I'm not sure. Uh, I know flying Pikmin in three are the literal worst, weakest Pikmin in existence. <laughs> I don't remember if whites have that distinction here. No, there's no treasure behind this thing, so it's optional. Whatever it is, probably an egg. It is an egg. Yeah, it might have neck. It might have sprays for you, so it's always a good idea to open the eggs, even if you don't need the nectar. <laughs> Saw that time. Fucking three rocks in one spot. That's nasty. It's not one. I can see it. Oh, sh. 
You react so slowly to those rocks. <laughs> I love this. I love how nervous this floor is making you. <laughs> okay, I don't want to lose too many of my Pikmin. Yeah, you actually have lost a decent amount of the rocks. I'm surprised I never thought the rocks were that hard to avoid. And you didn't have much trouble avoiding them before. Coming back here is actually pointless. There's nothing here except walls. There might be a hidden treasure. No, you, you would see it. It's right here. It would have to be right here, and you could see it. And the treasure detector's not going off either. This is actually just a waste of time. Due to the way that randomly generated, these walls don't lead anywhere. Okay. Spooky. I don't know why that one triggered when you were so far away. Oh boy, there's a lot of them in here. So the Mamuda um, probably will not be killed by a rock this time. I just throw them on. Even in the ground, throw them on. You don't have to trigger them before fighting them. Yeah, I just rush them. Oh, I hope that rock didn't kill any. I don't think it did. Didn't look like it. Oh, the Mamuda's gonna be... Well, actually, the Mamuda's a good thing here, because you can easily pluck a phone your Pikmin uprooted, and it'll turn them into flowers. If you did not have the pluck a phone, he'd be extremely annoying. Okay. There's a treasure... I think that I can way. see it. It's just on the ground. You don't... You only need to get rid of the it's enemies the that ground. are... Right. No, oh, that's, that's a different one. I'm pretty sure there's another one over there in the other room. Like, you see that green thing, Bleach? I'm pretty sure that's one, too. Probably like a bell pepper or something. Which way are you going? You're going the way where the creeping chrysanthemum is. Of course you are. Since we're going to kill this. None died. <laughs> you were really close, though. And that's why you should have just went f straight in the first place. Where are you going? Why do you always trigger them first? <sighs> this fucking thing Wait, can you here. Can you actually stun it before it comes out? Yeah, probably. You can do that with a lot of things. Emperor Bulblox gets just murdered by purples that way, remember? No, I don't think I remember. Oh, wait, you, no, you, I did. You did it to him, so. <laughs> oh, the mighty has fallen. Emperor Bulblox was mighty? No, I'm kidding. He was so hard. <laughs> in uh, what a joke. Look how they massacred my boy. If Pikmin 4 ever comes out, I would love for the Emperor of Black to just return, or some kind of, like, similar kind of enemy, and just, like, shit on people again. But no, I have a feeling they're gonna make the games easier and easier. I mean... Isn't Pik the targeted audience for Pikmin kids? I don't know, maybe. I wanna be accessible! I like the first game. I, I like the first game's um, time management. And the fact that you actually had stakes. In Pikmin 3, they try and make you they try and give you stakes, but it's so lenient it doesn't even matter. Pikmin 3, what happens is um you instead of treasures, you have to get in order like in order to survive, like you crash land again. In order to survive, you need to keep getting food. Just weirdly enough, something Olimar never actually needed to do himself. <laughs> But whatever, you, you need to get food, and you, you got you get the food in the form of fruit, which makes, like, juice. And that's how they survive. Each bottle of juice will last, will get you uh, enough for a day. So you actually start with only, like, three. So you have to keep getting fruit constantly, so that you oh, don't... Oh, shit, he ate a white. Oh, well, at least the white was useful. And a blue. He didn't get, so he didn't get stunned, like... Yeah, stunned. There's a bell, yeah, there's a bell pepper there. It's 
Yeah, so you listen to me though? I, yeah. um, that's how Pikmin 3 works. Now you think, oh, that's a neat idea because it's it, you just keep, uh, like, I, I really thought it was a great idea. <laughs> I can't really put into words exactly, but I thought it was cool. And I was, but then I was like super disappointed with how crazy easy it is to get fruit. Eventually, I had like 30 days worth of, of fruit. Like, you use one every day, but you get, like, five more in the one day. <laughs> okay, maybe it's not that crazy, but you know what I mean. It's so easy to stock up on it. You just... It, it's, it's, it's crazy. Fucking... <laughs> 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 Don't you start on the Crash Bandicoot's The Dark Souls of Platforming oh <laughs> Here we go. I can tell Cash. Pikmin 1 is The Dark Souls of RT. No, it's not even close. That's just. That was the dumbest article I read of how someone. Some people the did. Dark Souls of Insert Genre here. This is a meme and I love it. It's a dumb meme, but I can't what people have it. Games can be popular not because oh, they're easy or hard. Then again, some people are idiots when it comes to what is. I'll be frank, hard. Crash. I, I never beat Crash Bandicoot when I was a kid. It was too hard for me. Though to be fair, I never owned it. I only played it at a friend's house. But we never got pa we barely got past Ripper Root. That's I, how far in we got in the game. I never played it until the remake. Well, it's more or less the same game. And I was able to beat it then. Me too. Like, that was the only time I owned it. So, first time I played it to the end. Oh. Oh, it's this floor. Oh, I remember this floor. <laughs> okay, well, this will be fun. All right, Bleach. I'm going to implore you to, to take very careful note of what is on this floor. I saw them. No, oh, hi. What? That's a, nice, well, that's a nice surprise. I forgot they fall out of the sky for some reason. I'll use that later. Yeah, good idea. See which color you're low on after this battle. Okay, so you see there is one right there. But you also see there's a bunch of bomb rocks around. Yes, I know what to do. Don't worry. I have a plan of attack. It's okay. Called murdering him with whatever purples I have left. Oh, I don't think he's going to be cheesed with them. You only have ten. But, we'll see. Boo! Also, if you really want to cheese him, you throw him on before he gets up. Like, that... That that, that he can get up is... Oh, I see what you're going to do. Yeah. So, oh, too bad he, like, didn't give a shit about you at all. <laughs> Make sure he actually sees you, Bleach. <laughs> Maybe, like, walk in front of him, you know? Like, there we go. <laughs> yep, just like in Pikmin 1, he literally has the same animation, same everything, and but takes a lot more damage because he has, like, no HP. Throw him- ah, You're fucking on his back! Bleach his face, you idiot! Bleach, that literally did nothing. Yeah, I, that's a restart because of how many- Oh my me. god! <laughs> and then he stopped, like, 40 of them. You idiot! Th these things are pathetic. And he, like, threw- How did you- Okay. How did you I throw, thought it was on like, his face. I you threw, like, 40 of them on his back, and I was watching them all bounce off. How do you not see that? What are you looking at? I'm looking at the marker. I can't see it when it, he's- ah! <laughs> well, Okay, okay. How are you looking at the marker if you can't see it? Like I said, it's underneath him. I thought it was within his face range. Oh, look, he moved. <laughs> now he's in the water. Have fun. <laughs> you know where the treasures are. <laughs> 
They're definitely not going to be on the ground. There's two of them. Yep, there's two of them. I don't believe both of them have a treasure, so you might be able to skip one. Yeah, that one doesn't have one. You don't have to fight that one. Is there really only one treasure on this floor? Hmm. Seems like it. Yes, I guess you can lure him out of the water, but this is, he could just go back in. You're way too far away, Bleach. What the hell? He's not sure what he's doing. Um, this is funny, though. Ah, uh, <laughs> okay. Maybe it's because you... Oh, oh, all right, that was strange. Maybe, maybe it doesn't work when he's in water. It's weird, though. <laughs> That'd be funny. The problem is the p ship got repossessed, and that frickin' piggy bang probably went along with what? it. Oh, God. Yeah, we're gonna be here a while. It, that's just gonna set them all off, please, but okay. It, it might damage him. It didn't even damage him. Wow. It did! Oh, it did. I just can see his health bar. I'm not really surprised it damaged him because, like, bombs tend to do damage to things. Ow! I walked into that one. That was my own fault. <laughs> <laughs> You're trying too hard. These guys don't have HP anymore. Like, you already got him to, like, a... Th to like down by a third. I just just kill him. He's not regenerating at least. Yeah, you'd think he would. I don't I think the original might, I'm not remember. Or maybe nothing in that game does, I can't remember. This is really the dumbest way I'm battling him. I... Yeah. I'm no longer amused. Bring your friggin' army over here. By the time you get all the way over there, by the way, he's gonna be unstunned. Uh, yeah, he's gonna be unstunned, unfortunately, because he's too close to the water. I couldn't. Get You're him. not gonna be able to lure him far enough away because. Oh, he too. Oh, that's interesting. Oh my god, I think I can kill him this way. Yeah, you can just kill him with the bombs, I guess, but, like, this is so boring! Deal with it! Oh, I don't have much of a choice now, do I? Oh, he actually got that one. Nice. Okay. Well, goodbye. This guy has like no HP anymore. Yeah, I, I would have been. I would have liked it if they like kept his HP values not to like ridiculously weak levels. He doesn't have to. You don't have to make him an HP sponge like he was in the first game, but like, because he's not a final boss anymore. But. God, he's like, I swear he's weaker than, like, some basic enemies in terms of HP. Fucking Gatling Groinks are harder to kill than him, almost. Gatling Groink boss? <laughs> Imagine that. You think about it, there could be a lot of interesting enemies to make into boss. I guess, but like you think that, but then it's like, well, then what do they actually do? And then what's the what's the battle like? And then whenever that question comes up, I have no answers. Oops, I hit the wrong button. I just want to make sure they don't go for him. They take the shortest way. Oh, what if they do? Oh, D deal with it if he wakes up, then. Oh, that's, that requires almost none, wow. Good, take the land route. Good. Okay, good. Good, you're in the clear. You don't have to fight the other one. What a shame. Well, who knows, maybe I will have to do th this isn't the only treasure. I'm pretty sure he doesn't have the other treasure if there is one. There, and there is a second treasure, but I don't know where it is. I'm pretty sure he doesn't have it, but... Maybe he does? It's... 
Uh, it's probably buried under here now. That's what I would expect from this conspicuous ring of fire. Nice. Ooh, don't go near him yet. It's, he definitely doesn't have it because it's not going off. Oh, is it actually behind that gate now? No, that's the exit. Oh, yeah, it, it is. Be behind. Oh, there's another gate, though. It's behind that gate. Yeah. There it is. Well, that's, All right, that's, make that's blue to it. So can, actually, no, you can take make anything. You've got a pretty direct route to it. I got a pretty direct route. I'm just letting blues get started on it. And then it should be safe for the rest to come. Oh, hi. <laughs> it was a nice surprise for once. <laughs> the hell is that? Is that one of those, like, ha is that a, is that one of those, like, butter containers, like, from, like, diners and shit? I think so. <laughs> it's already open. <laughs> Do they have those in Japan, too? <laughs> What if this is like something on the label, or if you can even read it? Uh, no, not really. Well, there is a label, it's just hard to really see. Milk tub. Oh, maybe it oh, actually has milk in it. I don't know. I... Or it's probably one of those cream cups for coffee. Oh, that might be it. It is like, look, the only... Yeah, I don't drink coffee, so, but, but like, I. the first thing I thought of was like, one of those little butter packets from like, um, like IHOP or something. I used to put those creams in my chocolate milk when I was a kid. Hmm. Never thought of. Never had that before. Okay, which color? I yeah, reds are probably what. what Your I mean. reds took a hit from the uh, from the fiery bowl block, so refreshing them would probably be nice. Blue's the best sacrifice here. I have plenty of Yeah, prob still. probably. And we're not going to sit here and wait for them to sprout back into flowers. <laughs> so that's a waste of your time, and you'll be pissed at I me. I will literally just leave and go do something else if you did that. <laughs> Which I would imagine you would do, too, because nobody would, in their right mind, sit there for that long. And if we were in person, you would probably yeah, want to strangle me, me for doing that. Well, if you, like, lock me in a room and I had to sit here, yeah, I definitely would. We're halfway there after you beat this. Oh, Violet Candy Pop Buds. And another queen. This might be a rest floor. Ooh. This is. So I recommend... Honestly, I think you could use more purples. <laughs> In your party right now, not necessarily like overall. Five more will make it easier to cheese stuff. I don't know if you need more whites though. You can bypass the ivory candy pop buds. I'm gonna. Hmm. Okay, I think I'm gonna do. I'm gonna toss five. You also, have, you also yeah, you also have another queen, so bear that in mind. I can then sacrifice a blue to get more reds from the queen. Yeah, that's fine. There's no treasures here, thankfully. Yeah, so you can you're free to leave whenever. There's probably no enemies here either. Rest floor already. Oh, I accidentally tossed a blue into a blue by accident. That was by pure accident. Oh, now you got more blues. Woohoo. Sorry. Whatever. That was a miss. Apologizing to me for I don't care that much. You're gonna use this one after all. I'm just thinking. No, probably not. I think my. I mean, 
It is a somewhat viable strategy to use whites specifically for their poison properties by allowing them to be eaten. Eh. Oh, hi! Yeah. Well, get him. Might as well. You might as well. Can purple stun him? No, but they're better at hitting them. Purple's like home in on shit, like other Pikmin don't. So they're better at hitting the Flint Beetle. Oh, hi! An egg just fell from the ground as well. Two eggs fell from the sky. You don't even need the Flint Beetle. Oh, you kind of just wasted them all. Another one? All right. Oh, okay. Hey, I'm not going to complain. You don't have to throw, like, all of your purples on him. Jeez. I think you're all flowered. You might as well just go. Uh, there's only one leaf. Oh, God. Well... Or not. I think that's yeah, all I don't, of them. Yeah, yeah that's all of them. They They're all Good. flowers. Let's get, get out of here, then. Where is that last pigment? Ah, who cares? Wait. Huh? You're missing one. Uh, who cares? It's going to come with you anyway. What? You're 85 of 86, Bleach! It doesn't matter! Go! Maybe he fell into a wall somehow. Who the heck knows? Hmm. You know what I'm learning about? How would a boss fight work against, like, Emperor Bulblax and Empress Bulblax at the same time? <laughs> they don't really work together. How would that work? I don't know. Oh, look. Wallywogs. The regular kind. We haven't seen them in a while. Hmm. How many yells do you actually have? Not many. But you don't need a lot, fortunately. Oh, God. The water dump will... He got one. Um, that one's gonna be annoying. I can't get. <laughs> Maybe try. Uh. <laughs> well, you have your captains beat up the water dump until it dies. That's one way to get rid of it. Might as well have both of your captains doing it, not just Olimar. No, Purple, what are you doing? Uh, well, he just came over to you. I guess you can just kill him now. Oh, now he's going back. <laughs> wow, these things are very intelligent. Just kill him! What are you so scared of? I was trying to bait him out. So, what, so I didn't... You was baited out enough, but apparently you want him to go so far that he would just turn around, because that's what would happen. Okay, make sure that's a white... That's a blue, red, yellow. Oh shit! Yeah, the bleach! Uh, Why do you throw so many? Just... You have extremely few yellows. You have to be more careful than that. <laughs> if you had like I 20 thought I yellows, had that more. Be... How do you think of that? Like, you can see them. Yeah, like, that's the safe amount. Just do that and let them, like, wait a little while. I know, weird. I'm saying, I'm saying to wait, but in the situation, it's a gust idea. I've seen this floor design like way too many times. This template's really common. Damn the jump once and. Fuck you, Wallywalk. He had a treasure too. And oh, nice. Oh, 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 go! <laughs> How? He's... Water isn't nearly as dangerous as like electricity. <laughs> wow! Look at that! Look at that number. <laughs> One hundred. That's not what I meant. The, I mean the total you have. You have seventeen thousand nine hundred and ninety-nine. Gonna bother me. Oh, now it's now it's a. Uh, 18,006. Is it still gonna eh. bother you? Not as much. Is there anything back there? You might wanna like check and see if there's anything back there before going back there. There might not be, for all you know. It's like a really annoying area. There's a... What the? What was that? It's going backwards now. 
<coughs> Bless you. <coughs> Bless you. Thank, thank you. You only have to say once. <laughs> Okay, there's there a is something back there. Oh, 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 there's a hole, too. Okay, well, <laughs> I hate this place. Reaching with lightning. Let's see, though, what's here? Though? Yeah, this actually looks like the, uh... Where are you going? I'm seeing what else is here. There might be... Treasure. No, that, you know, this... I agree with this, but, like, where you were going at first was, like back the other way, and then you turned around. Yeah, I'm like back there, so just press on. I'm seeing a shortcut I can take. The... Hmm. No trap there. Why are you looking for traps? You don't have to go back there. Also, I wouldn't even call this... I wouldn't call this a shortcut if I were you. At least it gets me past without... Having to bring go through that pipe thing, I guess. Sure, I don't know if that matters. To cheese these things too, just swarm them. They're weak. Aguater uh, dumples are not to be feared. Only be feared if you're not paying attention to them. That one's kind of in a spot I don't like. Uh, I hate these stupid. Like, they're, they're they're very annoyingly positioned. Hmm. Yeah, this is your best bet. Try and lure him out. Good. Not okay. now, guys. And only blues should take those. Those were the two he ate. Those were the two he ate. That's why he did that. That's why they did that. When they die, when enemies die, they let go of whatever Pikmin they picked up and were about to eat. And the thing is, to eat them instantly, like the. Bulbor some of them do eat them, in. huh? Like the barbor, like the bulbor larvae. Yeah, some of them do eat them quite a, quite fast, but most of them take like a second. And if you kill them while they're still in their jaws, they get they get let out. They're not affected by your whistle until that point, so they immediately start trying to grab the corpse. These anode beetles are interesting. Hmm. Wait, I see that. I guess you'll have to be careful here because there are a lot of them in one spot. Purples are a good way to knock them over, though, because, like I said, they home when you throw them. Wait. Oh my god, they that Throw them now. Throw them now. Go, go, go. You'll knock them all over. If you did it when I said it, you would have been... Yeah, oh, wow. <laughs> Swarm them. There you go. Uh, that took too long. Shit! Uh oh! <gasps> that was close. Uh, you can ignore the last one if you want. No, I don't trust him because there's one all across over there. I do not think he can reach that one. I'm not giving him a chance. Poor anode beetle. They didn't even do anything to you. Careful of the water. I know. A death sentence for them if they fall on. Uh oh. Some whites are stuck in there. I can hate this stupid pipe. It's so annoying to get them out. Don't worry about them. Just, just trying to get your whole army stuck in there. It's not worth trying to get them out. They shouldn't take it through the water, I think. They won't. Pikmin are more intelligent than you give them credit for. Unless there is literally no way besides the water, they won't go there. Oh, they're going through the pipe. Well, yeah, that's that's yes, that is the fastest the way over here. That is go. the fastest way over here, Bleach. Your shortcut is not a shortcut. Wow, well, I have a lot of reds over here. That I was wondering why they were over there. I noticed you didn't have your full squad a while ago. Taking the blues because I think the blues are the best one to at least get the. I don't think you need them to get the mushroom, but. Uh, uh yes I. No, you don't. So that we do not need them, but I suppose they're safer if you fuck up. 
Why are you attempting to do it from down here? Like, you could have just won all along the side, huh? Okay, fine. Like, you know, like, up and then throw them across that gap? That's what it's for. Because I wasn't sure if I could make that gap. It's not even close. You could definitely make it. Oh, I don't know why they're not going for it, though. You, they're really not close they, enough they to are. the thing. They are. Oh, okay. They're uprooting it. That's why. <sighs> Is that a shiitake mushroom? Uh, no? Maybe. I'm not sure. Maybe it is. Kind of looks like one. I'm Not that I am a fan of mushrooms. Far from, far from it. <laughs> yeah, same yeah, here. I think, it, I think it is. I mean, I don't mind them if they're like ramen or fried rice or certain kind of food, but destroy mush <laughs> destroy mushrooms. I don't want them in anything. Yeah, 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 you can just stay there yeah, while you walk for all I care. I let you live for today, Wally Wog. Mm -hmm. You'll die another day. Phone? My phone is way too loud. My microphone's too sensitive, apparently. I like to think it's not as annoying as PLEASE DUDE! But, that's, that's just me. Do not just my... <laughs> <laughs> well, at least they're not the withering variety. Ow. <laughs> Cut it off, be so close to enemies! Because then they just hit you. It's a tight corner. There was nothing. You can be farther away. You've... You have to literally be on top of them for them to hit you with that. Fine. Is that my, my is my tone default? I guess. Not a ton of people use it. I don't like how you're close to though that gas. Can you move over, buddy? I don't either. Gonna have to hope he moves or go somewhere else. Okay. Like it's important to note that they move in the opposite direction from you. They generally try and keep their distance. So if you you can point them, try and point them away from the poison. In that case, one of them's getting poisoned. Oh shit! They walked into it. <laughs> what the treasure just <laughs> bounced over there for? I lost three. Pins. Yeah, you could have totally saved them, but you like didn't know for some they reason. They ran way over there. That my we ran out of my wishes reached since I got closer. Just miss your Pikmin and then walk over there. Captains don't die from the poison. I was a little afraid of what my Pikmin would do. No, well, if they also walked into the poison, you would have had plenty of time to save them. Whites. I can wow. do the thing you're good for. Oh, jeez. There's probably still. Yeah, okay. Hmm. Wait, what kind of bug is that? Well, that's the withering. Oh, fantastic. Maybe you don't have to go over there. I wouldn't even bother if you don't. There could be a treasure over there, but once well, until you get close. Definitely not over here, though. There's literally nothing there. <laughs> Ooh, 
Well, is there a reason ahead. you broke that wall? I just wanted to see what was there. You can see that by turning the camera. Nothing there. Thank God. You have to go over oh, here. Wait. He can go fuck himself. Nothing. Yep. I think it would have like. I think it would have pinged at least a little bit if there were actually things there. I don't know. I was hoping for an egg trap, I uh, guess. The reason I don't... I think they only put traps in corners that actually have something in it. I hate the fact that you're behind that wall, because you could eat my Pikmin. Yeah, I can think of many instances where the trap didn't also have bait. Can he eat them through the wall? Yes, yeah, he can. probably. Yeah, probably. He Whatever. Can. It's the only I way. That's the it. only way these things ever eaten anything. <laughs> now that he's out of the way. Guys, hold on to that. You know, actually, I just realized that Candy Pop Bud did fall in an area with nothing, so... But, maybe only Candy Pop Buds do. Oh, oh I guess I'm wrong. I guess the egg... Well, I don't think it's nearly as common as when there's bait, but... I guess it can happen. Oh, these fucking blowhogs, man. There's definitely treasure that way, I can tell. That's the only way that... Not the entrance, the exit hole is that way, so yeah, everything is that way. There... Wait, there's two. Oh, oh. Oh, well, whatever. Try and take out the poison when he's not there. So, like, now. You wait too long, he's going to come back. I'm trying to see. Okay. Oh, shit. I had the white. Uh... God damn it. <laughs> Wall in the way. <laughs> oh, my God. Now he's back. You wasted too much time. I'm making bait him. I got away from the leave again. That is now he's not gonna leave. I don't not he's not following you back here. There's no way. <laughs> okay, fine. That's sooner than I thought he would. I was waiting for you to throw that blue by accident. Alright, you should be able to just fight him now. There he is. Got him, and... He's dead. Excellent. Just swarmed him. I'm glad that Emperor Bullblax was the only bomb. Oh god, they went really close to that. Wait. I see the treasure. Wow, he missed. There's a 9 volt battery this time. That's how many batteries in this game? <laughs> he didn't miss that guy. Why do you keep zooming in? Stop! I want to make sure I have the right Pikmin. Wait, you're doing that on purpose? Yes, I want to make you sure I don't wait, accidentally- Wait, Look in the picture next to your little icon- Next to the number of Pikmin. That's how you know. Oh! Ah! <laughs> you didn't know that this whole time? <laughs> if I had to fucking zoom in. <laughs> God damn. Oh, <laughs> get me out of here. Come on, let's go. I mean, I could get you out of here in another way. What, what way? Uh, I'm kidding. I'm not going to use that way. That, that's, uh, You're going to kick me. Hilarious. I get it. <laughs> right. 
Well, I guess the treasure's behind. Yeah, we already saw it. It's the nine volt battery. <laughs> I wouldn't look very responsible doing that unless you really pissed me off, which you come close only came close only once, I think, or only did really piss me off once, but not enough to make me actually want to kick you. Cool. That is a compliment, just to, be, to make sure you... Okay, I didn't ask. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Alright, as soon as that one gets back, just jump in. I'm, I mean, shouldn't I have a captain get these it guys? It doesn't matter, but okay. And fuel reservoir. It's not incorrect. <laughs> when is the ship ever correct? Ship is doing its best. It's like I'm doing my best uh, yes, to actually play the game right. All right, three more to go. Oh, good lord. This... Oh, multiple Gatling Groinks. Oh, my favorite. I think I also remember this floor, too. And a lot of dwarf bulb orbs. Wow, that's a lot of them. Well, let's, let's methodically take them out. The, the only way these things are going to be a big problem is if the Groinks attack while you're dealing with them. You're going to have to keep an eye oh, on them. You, you, yep, yep, like yep. I said, you're going to have to keep an eye on them. Good job doing that. <laughs> you better kill him. He's not going to leave you alone. I know. Oh, wow. I don't know if that's necessary. Oh, here comes the other one. Oh dear. This is a b very bad floor. I'm taking a major hit. Get him out of the way. Get him out of the way. Okay. One down. <laughs> I don't know how many you lost, but it was less than I thought you might. And the good news is the groinks can be like... baited to areas where you want to fight them. <laughs> Preferably not in the midst of a million dwarf bull boards. Yeah, the good news is those things are the only significant threat on this floor. There are a lot of these things, but you can take them one at a time, so who cares? Yeah, like... The only thing this would have been at these... Reason these... Bull would have been a threat if they were the lava variety. Yeah, please. You gotta keep watching the groin. Like, <laughs> till he's dead, you still have threats. I didn't kill any of them that time. Uh, that was are probably dead though. Oh no, they're not. What are you trying to do? You got stunned again. Oh, I didn't realize I was in front. That was my bad. Oh my god. Got him. Somehow through that madness, you only lost two. <laughs> Three. I think so the dwarf bulb orb snuck. It's possible. I don't know if that guy actually... I know he was trying to. I don't know if he actually got any. I think he did manage to get a few. Very surprised that Groink didn't kill more. <laughs> well, God, this place is living up to its name. I'm gonna say that right now. Get rid of chaos. <laughs> it's very chaotic, <laughs> just like you like it. It's <laughs> no fun if it's not chaotic. 
Blaster would probably prefer that every floor had one dwarf bulb orb, and then all the treasures just out in the out in the open. Oh, I didn't assume anything. I said that you prefer, you know, this thing to me. Oh no, I I like some uh, dungeons being hard, to be honest. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I don't think I finished what I was told you of how the only way I finished the 994 dungeons in the original Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. I don't think I finished telling you. No, you didn't. The only reason I was able to finish those ones was because back then they had an online rescue board form that you could just post the rescue code online and some yeah. rando would save you. Makes sense. That's the only way I was able to do them on my own online. Just have a rando save me every time I died. <laughs> so you really didn't do it on your own then. How many times did you die? A lot. I, I'm going to say. <laughs> so yeah, I don't really know if that counts. If you ask me, but that's something I guess. But hey, at least it's hopefully better in DX from what I can... Uh, tell from Chuggers. Uh, what do you mean by better? You mean easier? Yeah. <laughs> Roguelikes are generally hard, and they should be. I mean, a lot of people I talk to say that in comparison to most roguelikes, Pokemon Mystery Dungeon, it, even in the original, it was still the more yeah. friendly one. I I don't agree with like such harsh consequences for losing. Such as would usually, these games would usually have permadeath, things like that. Um, I think Pokemon had a pretty good, had a pretty reasonable cost for losing. Lose half your items, all your money, all your held items. It's pretty steep. Definitely. And the dungeons were by no means easy to get through. But if they're, but like, like I think the original is already easy enough. The optional shit was the real hard stuff. The main story was not too bad. Oh, some of the optional stuff in the DX it can be still pretty hard. Like some I hope so, things. but like, like I will. You know, maybe, maybe, I, maybe you could stand making the original, sto the main story, a little easier. Like I remember struggling on the legendary bird section for a long time. I think I. Oh yes, I. The one that gave me the most trouble my first time was Articuno, mainly because. Hold him up. Alexa, stop. As long as he goes Alexa, stop. He'll be... Every day, like clockwork. <laughs> sure. anyway, I remember Articuno just giving the most stroke of mini because fucking Powder Snow. Powder Snow is probably an area attack move. Yeah. It, it was, but now they took it. Attack move. Now that it's not an area attack move in DX. Now Blizzard's the area attack move. Uh, Blizzard was also a room attack move in original 2. <laughs> That's why I like using it. Oh, I gave it. I now use, I use it on my with the mud kit. That's me. Yeah. <sighs> man, what do you guys think? Uh, I'll make... try it yet eventually. But man, you know what? I wish they remake more of the second game. I like it way more. <laughs> I'm willing to bet if DX sells well, they'll uh, likely remake the second game. Hope so. Considering that they brought in moves from. Uh, all the generations so far, even. Oh, that doesn't mean anything. <laughs> what? That doesn't mean anything. I just that's just uh, modernizing it. Just like I they modernized makers. I was surprised that they would, if they didn't do that. To be honest. But yeah, the like fact the... that they're still doing megas is nice, considering they've just forgotten megas exist in the latest generation. Oh, dude, I was just flat say, say some of the. Uh, bosses that actually can go mega uh, are tell actually me. pretty tough. Don't tell me. Oh, it's only post game, and no, it's obvious still. which ones uh, would oh, go. Okay, well, whatever then. <laughs> It'd have been cool if like something did that main story out of nowhere. It's like, wait, that didn't happen. Ooh. Imagine just fighting Rayquaza and then suddenly Mega Rayquaza. I mean, like fucking god. <laughs> Well, Crazy was the only other boss that gave me a lot of 
trouble, but that's because ba but that's because back then, then when I first fought him on the GPA, I had really nothing to handle a dragon flying type. I had yeah, Pikachu I and Mudkip. I, I have Bulbasaur. God. DX, once I got Blizzard, I'm like, okay, uh, that's uh, good enough. Plus, Pikachu, I think I had a Bulbasaur and Squirtle. My plus, Pikachu like, had elect plus, Pikachu had Electro. Plus, Pikachu had Electro Ball, which is just like godly OP on Pikachu. I'm far out saying Pikachu with Electro Ball in Mr. Dungeon DX, probably one of the more broken things in that game. Is Fury Attack still broken? <laughs> Yep. There's a reason Chugga and his LP got a skitty. My death to Beedrill is still exonerated by that. Ch in Chugga's LP, he got skitty and he was surprised and decided to just go with it for his first uh, with his yeah. pick. And he yeah. has Blizzard and Double Slap. Very back and Double Slap. How does it have Blizzard? That's weird. It's for room nuking. Did he give it Blizzard or did it yes. learn it? He's... Okay, I was gonna say, it should be able to learn that. Or it shouldn't learn that on its own. You're done here, by the way. Just go for the exit. All oh, right. Hmm. Charge! I'm actually shocked you did that. You really thought I wouldn't thought. do it? Yeah, you're usually a big baby. <laughs> like, I suppose if there are a bunch of rocks oh! in your way. You oh, actually, that. Cash, with you mentioning that, that reminds me of something that I was actually kind of do love. Uh, but about the DX. You can actually recruit the evolutions of some Pokemon. Right, you couldn't before. Uh, yeah, you had to, uh, you, you had to get them from their base form. Are you sure? That was, yes. that was a rule? Oh. Hmm. Well, that's annoying. That's nice. That's a nice change. Unfortunately, that Dorinji bug doesn't actually notice you. He does now, though. I think. I can't tell. Oh, this floor looks annoying. Tell me about it. God's name is that treasure. Oh, boy. Wait, I think he got stuck on the ground underneath the... Nah, he definitely not get stuck. He just he, the ground is lower, so he floated lower. That's all that happened. Okay. I'm gonna wait for him to go down lower. Come on, go. <laughs> Thank you. I might be waiting here a while. Mm, there. Go on. Go further down. Yes. Okay, that's good. Can ninja bleach here. <laughs> oh, he's coming now. There's still lights over there. Another oh, no, they're on. Why didn't he throw that bomb at then? Okay, good oh, job. Oh, there idiot. was one right. He got stuck in the wall. Oh, okay. I was right then. You just have to make sure you don't miss or use only blues. You're far enough away from the bomb blade. Like he, they, he drops it really far away when you make him drop it. Okay, you can make one this time. Fortunately, I... Oh, God, that was close. He doesn't really shake your Pikmin off very far, I was just about to say. But he almost fell in the water anyway. What is that thing? I think it's one of those, like, bobble toys. I want to say bobble head, but it doesn't have a body, so that's... Yes. Well, well, I, I think that description would still be accurate, because it is a head, and it bobbles. Even if it's not what we usually refer to as bobblehead. Oh! Oh, there's a fucking bumbling stitch bug in there. I didn't see him. Great. That could actually be a real problem. If he grabs your Pikmin and they automatically get dismissed, some of them might just walk into the water. 
Be very careful of that guy. But yeah, I will if you're lucky, you won't have to deal with him. If this is the last treasure, you can probably just ignore him. There was a blue in there. Did you see him? I got him. Wait, actually, can the bomb take those out? Uh, probably. Takes out the other hazards. So yeah, just make him throw it. Hey, buddy. I don't know if it kill the. It's probably too far away from the other one, but it probably kills that one. Yep. I wonder if you even need to kill that last one, to be honest. It would make fighting him feel safer, honestly. That's true. <laughs> Things are so predictable. Go get him. That's a little close. Only because the corner was there. Good. Got him. This time he's dead. It's a hood ornament for cars? Oh. <laughs> that sounds like something very Japanese. I don't think I'd see anything like that over here. But yeah, I will say that even though I haven't fought them yet, Kekleon is still as devastating as it ever, though. Well, he's supposed to be. That just reminds me that I've never actually recruited a Kekleon any time I played Mystery Dungeon. I think the only way to get them is by is by beating up the shopkeepers. No, I've done that. All the time, I was a level 100 Swampert in my original, and even still, they refused to join. I even had the friend bow equipped. It doesn't make it guaranteed. It probably just take. It's probably just a really low chance. Yeah. Uh, but there, I would say this: the, there's only two 99 floor dungeons that I could not do personally. All right, here we are, the boss. Yeah. Before that. The two 994 dungeons I couldn't do personally, and I think you know why when I say their names. Joyous Tower and Purity Forest. I don't remember what they're called, Bleach. I don't well, that's remember many name. of them. I know, and I don't remember many of them at all from that game, to be honest. They are 994 dungeons that reset your know. level to one. Oh, so one of those. Okay. There are a lot of them, so I don't remember them all. Those are the only two that did that. No, there were yes. like the... I Maybe I'm thinking of the second game then, because there's only like an I an island that had a bunch that did that. Huh? You're probably thinking of the second game then. Hmm. Whoa! And here you are. I. Honestly, forgot what this thing's called. Oh! Well, there goes that guy. <laughs> oh crap! Oh crap! <laughs> All right. You see what you need to do, but you gotta be faster than that. That guy's dead. <laughs> or it definitely helps having flowers. <laughs> definitely helps having flowers. You didn't see what you did before. Yeah, I see. <clears throat> I lost a good chunk of my Pikmin, unfortunately. And. Oop. <laughs> not even close to getting them on. Oh what? boy, and he regens health. Oh, at least you get that. How nice. That may not have been a good time to get it, though. Good. How do I even get them? You can get them up there. You just weren't getting good throws. There you go. Oh my Whoa! God. That doesn't kill them. It just knocks them around. And it removes their lee. Oh, crucially! Oh, crap! Their power. Wow, that's nearly picked an extinction. Time to reset. Yeah, okay, so crucially, 
It does not kill them, but it does remove all their flowers, making him very easy to run over. This guy's no joke. <laughs> Forgot how tough, oh. tough he is. This is gonna be a tough boss, isn't it? Mm -hmm. What's this guy's name again? The Segmented Crobster. There you are. Whew. I'm gonna find out say this from what I've seen. This guy. Tougher than the Empress Bowblax when she was uh, setting out the larva. Oh, wait, uh, wait, she fought him for maybe uh, two minutes. I wouldn't be so quick to judge yet. As soon as he wiped the floor with you, doesn't mean he's... And the first try doesn't mean it's the hardest thing ever. You, you, you should stay zoomed out. There is no reason to be zoomed in. In fact, I, I argue there's no reason to be zoomed in ever in this game. Stop zooming! Also, if you want to avoid your Pikmin getting run over, try and aim him for a wall immediately instead of running him around the room. The longer you do that, the more chances he has to hit them. And you should probably um, spicy them up before he's vulnerable so you have more time. There you go. Oh, that didn't hit him, really. Okay, move a little bit closer. There you go. And he will all, all rocks always fall when he hits the wall. It, yeah, you're not getting on him. You need to like change your camera around, Bleach. And now you are. Oh, okay, that's a good chunk. Oh, that's not good. It's fine as long as they have the spicy spray, but their leaves, their flowers are gone. Their good news is there is nectar falling from the rocks. For some eggs, apparently fall with the rocks. You really got to change your camera around because you're like just just press okay. L. <laughs> It's far easier to get a to get a get a good throwing angle on them on that. Guys, case. no, it's not the time for drinking nectar. Well, I you, I don't know why you think thought they wouldn't do that when you ran over them. Wait, L, you you can't you can't you, you get a better angle if you. It's easier to aim if you like change your camera. That was bad. Uh, you're throwing him into the claws now. This is. Oof. He doesn't give you much much vulnerability time, does he? But you can get good at luring him into a wall. Like this. This is pretty good. The rocks do attempt to fall on you, so yeah, yeah, as you probably noticed. Ooh, there we go. You finally got the god Ooh. angle. That's not good, though. Yeah, lure him to a wall. Oh, ASAP. shit. Yeah, you're, you're not doing a very good job luring him into a wall. You could still win with nine Pikmin, technically. It's gonna be... Gonna suck. Ah! Uh, uh, debatable whether that's going to work. I don't care. Oh, I was... <laughs> oh, at least they fell off them. Now you throw them back on. I don't even know why they fell off. That was weird. There's one purple on there. He, he's doing work. <laughs> Can you use all your bitter sprays in this guy? I was just reset. If he breaks... Yep, I'm going to have to reset. Pur purple aren't even getting on there. <laughs> oh, my God. What? Right, the game kills you, like, twice, and you get this mad? Eh. I'm not angry. How uh, did I know I was angry? I was like, oh, my God. Because you're like... Ah! That was I don't a know, sigh. That kind of sounds angry to me, if you ask. That me. was a sigh. <sighs> That's a sigh. Yeah, sure. Totally. <laughs> How am I supposed to think? <laughs> I am not angry. Mm -hmm. You obviously haven't seen me play a lot of games. Games to know the difference between when I'm actually legit angry and focused. I was judging it based on one noise you made, Bleach. Excuse me. I can obviously tell you're not. This isn't good. I think you want to. You should probably do that before the fight even starts. Because, like, the speed you get from. Oh, my way. Uh, this. I'll make. <laughs> okay, well, it's definitely... <sighs> I suppose you could almost one cycle him like that. I don't think you were getting all of them on him. 
No, I wasn't, unfortunately. Yeah, use the spicy spray before the battle even starts. And then, yeah, position yourself like this so that when he rolls, he goes right into the wall. What is he doing? There we go. See, you don't want to be at an angle like that because, like, he can almost miss the wall. Ooh. Now you're crushing him. Got him. All right. Good job. I do, like, I do enjoy this boss. Can he be head all? Oh, yeah, yeah, really? What the... <laughs> I... It's all, okay. It's also not. It's also not a special treasure. This is the first. This is might be the first one that's not. Okay. I don't remember the boss, but I actually remember that treasure from Turgus LP for some reason. Yeah. <laughs> that's because the treasure is ridiculously weird. No, he like didn't see what the treasure dropped, and then when he turned the camera angle to look past the boss's corpse to see it, the face was just right there looking at him and freaked him out. Silencer. Yeah, that's a good name for it. So he it's actually got So he actually got jump scared by the treasure. One, one look at that thing and you definitely be silenced. Scruntled sighs a sigh. Oh my god, fine. I'm wrong. Excuse me. Oh, that was actually a big wipe. I'm gonna be a little afraid to see how many I lost in battle with the results. Definitely after the stream, but for the next uh, one, I'm going to likely go back and grind up my no Pikmin numbers as well as more potions. Because that was a rough one. Okay. Here we go. Oof! <laughs> it's not as bad as some of the other ones. How many did I lose against? I think Frontier Cavern kicked your ass more than this. I think so. It was like 75, wasn't it? I hesitate. You may have gone up to like 80. Like the boss, was, the, final, the boss of that one was an absolute train wreck. Because you said, like, I got one part of the strategy, but I forgot the second yeah, part. Yeah, like the other part where you, like, don't lose all your Pikmin to the larva. <laughs> it's a pretty important part. <laughs> All right. Have you had your fill for the day? Wait. What the? Oh no. What? The control is not working. For some reason. Oh good. Well, I guess we gotta fix that. Well, we can kiss this day goodbye if you don't fix it <laughs> soon. Okay. There we go. Just was a simple unplug. All right. So. All right, so is that enough for you today, or you want to do more? I'm going to try and figure out what... Oh, you might as well spend the rest of this day doing something. I to explore I'm... the area more. What I'm going to try and do... is... Use my blues to open up a bit more of the area. Oh, good lord! Oh, he's here. He is. I told you he'd come over here eventually. <laughs> God, this guy's like the Smoky Prog. He actually attacks your base. Seriously, I don't know why you keep the camera like this. <laughs> Where are you going, buddy? It's going. Okay, I'll make sure you get him immediately. Wow, he tossed them everywhere. Fucking group chats, goddamn. What about group chats? Getting messages from them.
them out on him. The cursor is like, yeah. Actually, you're better off, when they're on him and he's in the air, you're better off letting him fall before whistling them. They'll, they'll be knocked off and they might lose a flower, but that's better than you potentially calling them off and then falling underneath and just get squashed. He'll never squash Pikmin that are on him when he falls down. That's a fiery one, be careful. I know. Yeah, so this is why, like, the fire hazards in this game are barely a threat. Just whistling back, instant recovery. In Pikmin 1, you had a lot less time to react, so it would actually be pretty threatening. If you're not paying get... attention. But here, get... it's almost like a joke, if you ask me. I'm gonna try and get this bridge at least built across. It's probably gonna be... Apparently some people actually do mod Pikmin 2. I don't know. They've made, like... The only mod I've ever seen that I ever, like... I never looked for any. I was like, this really stupid one that just puts overpowered enemies everywhere. <laughs> I wonder what I wonder what like like a remix of of like the levels in Pikmin could possibly be. You probably can't change the levels themselves, but you could you could probably change enemy placement and stuff like that. I wonder what it would be like if anybody's ever made that. Two orange bulbs in there. Hmm. Yeah, before we end off off the stream, I want to. I know it's going to probably cost me another day, but I want to at least open that up so that way I have an easier route. Okay, so you want to get to the next hole then? All right, fair enough. Have the next hole open up. I'm assuming. Good idea. That's fine. Oops. You could even enter the hole and then just stop because it saves. Uh, but then I won't. But I'm going to grind up more potion. Oh. There is a potion grinding area in this place. You could go and try and find that. Guess I can go find that. Yeah, I never really listened to. I never really listened to this music very much, or really thought about how ominous it sounds. But it really does sound ominous. Oh hi guys. Um. <laughs> they followed you all the way back over here. You guys are sick. Oh, those are creeping Cassandra. They, right they are. They all are. See the air? You see the spots on the ground? Those are the onions were. Okay, that's another That's hole. one hole. That's probably that's definitely Hole of Heroes, if I had to guess. I'm sorry for spoiling the name, but you'll see it soon. I'm pretty sure the one where the um the engine of the ship it was in Pikmin One is Dream Den. I might have them mixed up, but I think that's the way it is. I can't figure out how to get to that thing. Well you in the previous game in the previous game you used a a geyser to get Olimar up there, if I remember right, and you threw your Pikmin, but those geysers don't really exist in this game, so you'll have to find another way. Wait! Oh! <laughs> Are the groin killed an enemy while, while it's shooting your ship? Yeah, that sounds about right. These fucking guys have no concern for anything else. They just have immense hatred for Pikmin for some reason. Man, you got half your original debt from just that one dungeon. Purple took a hit. I know, actually, I know, I know, actually, no. It was, most of it was from that stupid weight thing for 3,000. Actually, the hit didn't. Look as bad as I thought it would be. Yeah, you didn't lose any. 
No mint. Overall, you didn't lose any. Your number of blues went up by a fuck ton because you farmed a lot at the end. Which pretty much offset every, all your losses. Party 2 in battle, yeah, that's fine. Helps that you played extremely safe against the other bull blocks, but honestly, he wasn't going to kill that many anyway. His grandma's worried. I feel sorry for grandma. Better hurry up and rescue Louie. <laughs> If not for him, just for his grandma. He's got some explaining to do. What? He got some explaining to do. What are you talking about? Louis. For what? Make what are you talking? Worry. Bleach. You, you think he wants to be like trapped on the planet alone? I don't know what Louie I mean, thinks. I would imagine that's not the case. Actually, because in case you forgot, you literally die here in this atmosphere once, this runs out, once he runs out of whatever the fuck gas he breathes. Which you think would be it put a time limit on your um, t on your uh, days to get Louie, but of course it doesn't. <laughs> time limits were for Pikmin 1 and nothing else. <laughs> And that's except for the quote time limit in Pikmin 3, which is a joke. Not to be honest, I never really found Pikmin 1 all that hard to beat the time limit under either. All the more reason I think they shouldn't have kept nerfing it every game. Four drinks for yourself, your mom, and any other guests who say cheers. I would tell you what drink I want, but I can't drink. You're not gonna say anything to Alexa. <laughs> I'm ignoring her this time. <laughs> Just gonna pretend she's not there. Good. I'm focused right now trying to figure out how do I get up there. Mm, I don't even know how to get up there. My memories of Whistle Wild are very hazy. Ah! I see how to get up there. And yeah, that's definitely Hole of Heroes. Actually, maybe it's not. I could be wrong. Now, now, okay, now I'm second guessing myself again. Wait, there's another. There's another. Yeah, yeah one of them is Dream Den. I just don't remember which one. Oh, right, there's a wall there that only blues can enter, and I can't get... There is a way over there, Bleach. Oh. Oh, you jerk. <laughs> Just remove him, and you have a way in. Just need blues. You should do that while the whites are still going. That's what I'm going to do. Wow, you have more blues than, like, reds now. I think you have too many. <laughs> Honestly, I w was purposely trying to overload because I didn't know how many I'd lose within here. Within this place. Mm-hmm. So fun fact, these guys actually come in multiple sizes. That's one of the small ones. I don't really know why. They kind of function the same no matter what size they are. Well, you're definitely not going to want the whites for this part. 
Uh, you want to? You might want to run in and see what that that hole is. It might. I'm be going to road. once the whites are done. Good plan. The blues ought to take less time with that wall, but I'm not too concerned about the blues because they can just then take. Yeah, this they're, they're not going to take very long with that they wall. They can just take things, that that thing back. It's a white wall, so it'll take less time than the black wall, and I there are also more of them unclog beating. Unclog that up. water as well, from the looks Ooh, of it. Oh yes, you're cur glad you noticed that. I think I see where the so, plants are. Oh uh, yeah, though. see all the mold. That's definitely where the plants spawn. As you beat up the mold. So this could be an area, good area then to grind, depending. On it what definitely you is. Like I don't remember what color those are, but they. I want to say they're purple. Which is pretty good. But you need both colors. It might be that they're both colors. I don't remember. I want to say it's probably likely two of... Ah, uh, I know where this is. This is the landing site for the final trial. And those and those mold spots are on the exact areas where the onions were. All right. Let's go okay, see what this uh, dungeon is. you guys to safety right there. I think there's no groin left. <laughs> See what dungeon is this? Oh my God! You he oh. can't do, he can't do anything. Yeah, that's the dream den. Yeah, stream den. It's weird how dream den seems to be easier to reach than the other one. <laughs> hmm. We can wait. <laughs> he still attacked me. Yeah, that doesn't mean he's gonna hit you. You're almost certainly invincible in the cutscene, but I guess I've never tested that. I'll just beat up the mold. I wouldn't bother bringing him back. Or, or, yeah, uncork the water first. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Uncork the water first, let them bring the, hit, hit him back. Why did you whistle them back, then? I don't know. <laughs> okay. You're confusing me. I'm confusing you. Stop My using, fault. Stop using confusion. I think you mean confuse, right? Where's your confusion's chance is, like, some tiny 10%. Pretty sure it is. Yeah, exactly. It's terrible. And you're more likely a ghost type than a psychic type. Confused Ray is learned by ghosts. <laughs> That's what I said. You're more likely a ghost type than a psychic oh. type. Might as well beat up the mold with the remaining time of your day. Or find a way to get the whole of heroes. You're close. I think I see how. I need to uh, open yep. gate. Electrical oh, what a waste of that spray, man. It's fine. It's fine, because that's a... So, you should get yellows over here and bash the wall down now. No time like the present. I mean, there's a water... Get as many... Just get as many... So, it's a what? There's a watery blowhog there, and I don't want him to... Kill it, then! That's what I'm going to do with the blues! You could just kill him with the blues that are already there. You don't take more. Take as many yells as possible. You don't want to waste time on this. Those yellow gates take forever, please. Take more. Like, fill your capacity. Who cares? Thank you. I would, I would say put the blues you have away and get me more yellows, but whatever. Did one get caught behind the wall? No. It, it doesn't matter. It's, it's, it's not very important. <laughs> yeah, I really think you want to get that gate down today. So you don't have an impe any impediments in your way tomorrow. So. Also, the gate is so far away from the watery blowhog, he wouldn't have even bothered them.
If you're just gonna do this, why'd you even bother taking blues? <laughs> Wait, what? You missed, you missed one. You missed two, in fact. He's right next to you. I, I can see him struggling I couldn't see air. him! <laughs> He's oh. like, what? Help me! Help me! Help me! <laughs> you fucking don't see him. <laughs> wow. Rest in peace, yellow. Bleach didn't notice you. <laughs> ah, now you don't have 50. Now you only have 49. You'll forever be reminded of that. <laughs> so what color berries did they get? Oh, he's already eating them. Kill, kill him. Kill the, kill the grub. Why'd you whistle him back? <laughs> I didn't whistle. You you did. You threw the blue on, whistled them back, and then threw them back on. All right, fuck that grub up. All right, so those ones are red. I wonder if they're all red. I'd be disappointed if they're all red. Oh, good. That gate is. We're getting good progress on that gate. So does this imply that the final trial and um, the, the landing site were in the same area the whole time? I think it does. <laughs> that was real weird. How come Olimar couldn't fly to the final trial until he had almost all his ship parts in if it was right next door? He didn't know. I guess, but then how does getting ship parts help him know? I don't know. Oh, wow, it's done. Excellent. I think it's more important to get your berries than take those back. That's red. So uh, they're probably all red then. That sucks. I want to hope that some of them are blue. We might have to actually go to Perplexing Pool to farm purples. Oh, that's unfortunate. Ah, uh, Cannon Beetle. You might want to kill him for... Well, I would I just rush him down with your whole squad. Or, or do this. Okay, well... Rush him then. I I I think you would. I think you're gonna think. He's gonna likely you, respond. I'm just just stop, just make your Pikmin dodge. He doesn't even see you. Okay. He maybe kill one. Oh look a treasure! Glad you came over here anyway. And I'll tell you this: that thing leads directly to the hole. I wouldn't bother going up it until you're ready to go in. Yeah, since we now know that's the hole of heroes. Yep. We got another treasure. They're all red. Yeah, they're all red. That sucks. Well, might as well stock up on them. This is the best. This is hands down the best farm site for reds. Unfortunately, if you want purples, we're gonna have to go back to Perplexing Pool. I don't really recommend, but hey, if you're in dire need of them, go ahead. I think it might be better to wait. Hold on. Oh, 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 okay, okay. It's random. It's, ra it's somewhat random. They actually yeah. have like multiple colors. That's how this thing works. Look, oh, they're purple and blue yeah, and red on that one. Well, get it. I don't know if I have enough of the time of the day to get it back. I it's... think you do. If you don't, well, if you just file the Pikmin then. If you don't, whistle them back. There's no, there's no risk to trying. So that's how this one works. Okay. Forgot about that. So then, officially, this is the best spot to grind. I beer. guess. I mean, I don't know if... I, it seems like red ones are more common than purples. So if you want only purples, Perplexing Pool is still probably better. But, yeah, it seems pretty good. Huh, that's interesting. And that gets that treasure, which makes, I believe, two above ground treasures done. Out of, I think there was five total in this.
You're not going to make it. We got a red one at least. So I can at least grind here. Yeah, you can. Okay, um, Bleach, I'm apparently wrong. Those berries are in Pikmin 3. I don't remember them, though, for some reason. Interesting. Very interesting indeed. She's just going to repeat this message over and over again. I could have sworn I saw it before. No, she didn't send that. Oh. Hmm? Oh, yeah. That did send that one already. That's weird. Maybe they're starting to run out. No, she's really worried about Louie. Don't blame her. Uh, well, I guess that means we're done today. Yeah, so... I, off screen, I am going to grind... Maybe a bit more Pikmin, grind up those berries. Worst case, probably I don't need any more Pikmin if you ask me, but just maybe yellows. That's it. Yeah. And let me just check on the calendar so I know for certain. August 5th, then it will be. We will. <laughs> what? I'm yawning. I oh, said. I thought you, you were saying something. No. So, yeah, August 5th, we will do. The whole of heroes and hopefully finish up the last three above ground treasures, which will see the last stream being for a dream den. Yeah, that's good. That's gonna be my goal August fifth. That we're hopefully not gonna stop. Yeah, streaming. you can probably get whole of heroes and the last above ground treasures, and then one episode for dream den. Seems fine. After that, who knows what'll be next after this for or Bexy? I might jump Is straight into Thousand Year Door. I might. Just go to Metroid Prime 3. Take your pick. I'm thinking of saving Dead Space uh, 2 for October, though. Oh, I like the way you think. Yeah, the only thing I'll say, though, for Thousand New Doors, you're going to have to forget. I know it's probably going to be very easy and levels don't matter, but you're going to have to forgive me if I feel the need to grind off screen just to help level wise. Right. Yeah, thank you all for joining. Thank you as well, Polygon, for joining as always. Both for your uh, company and your comedic moments. Of course. And we will see you all. Saturday for a new stream for RPG Night since finally finished XD at 100%. What's, on, what's the next game you're playing? Um, I'm actually... No, we're probably not going to do battle. Uh, no, you don't even know. Oh, you don't know yet. Okay. No, I know what uh, the next game is. It's just a matter of who's going to join me possibly for it. Oh, I asked you what the game was. I don't care who's joining. Uh, Digimon World 4. God, <laughs> all right, you go and have fun with that. I actually did like that game a lot. I, I, okay, cool. I didn't ask. I said have fun with it. Yep. I don't and know what point. and Sunday, hopefully this time for real, we'll finish the final boss of Doom since I had to use last Sunday to finish XD. Yeah, stupid mirror B. And yeah, that'll be it for, for for now. Until then, later on, and have a good rest of your day. All right.